Hello again. How's it going, everybody? Bonjour. Bonjour. Um, checking for availability to merge automatically. Um, is what I'm seeing on the site. Uh oh. Did uh. Oh shit. Uh, my overlay just broke. Uh, why? User ranks. Invalid user ranks. Global.user ranks. Did I remove it first? Let's see. Also, a new camera, by the way. Check it out. What do you guys think? Yeah, let me fix this. Uh, we just broke our overlay, so uh, I'm not sure. What just happened? Uh, let me see. Uh, you know what's weird? You know what's very weird? Um, user ranks. We I think we have two global scripts, and for some reason, I don't know why the hell we have two. What the fuck? Did I delete it yesterday? Did I put it in my user manager? Oh, I think I put it in the U I removed it from okay wait wait let's go back I put it in my U user manager not uh yeah global whoops All right, so I think first, second, and third were, again, not added. Ooh. Hair got a chat. <laughs> yeah, the wind is on me. Wind is kind of crazy at the moment. All right, I think we fixed it. Shit. Oil up. I did oil up. What's up? How's it going, people? Let me say hi to everybody. So yeah, we also have a leaderboard now. Um, okay, overlay should be good. How's my hair? Is my hair kind of crazy right now? I did oil up. You can approve now? Okay, let me see. Give me one second. So many things are happening at once. Uh, so the site will probably be down for a second. Or not down, but it won't update. Okay, here we go. Uh, confirm merge. Also, score, I believe, does not work. Exclamation score. You have to check for a specific uh, reward. All right. Technically, my overlay still shows the data, shows the information. So, like, if you do score hello there or something, it'll show. Yeah, so uh, exclamation leaderboard now should work. And oh, let me get rid of uh, stream elements. And also, wait, let me bring back the chat to Let's see right there. Alrighty, people. Good morning. Good afternoon, good night, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Add your first. Give me one second, please. I already forgot. How do I add first?
Who was first, second, and third? Uh, any thirds? Nor the pole, okay. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Add points, Camilo's first. Let's see. Uh, no, that was stream elements. I think it's add points, underscore, add underscore points. Here, wait, let me just look at the code here. Uh, yeah, add points. All right. And then we have, oh yeah. Tomer bar, second, fuck, I keep, I keep, right, and then nor the pole for third. All right, there we go. Hello, everybody. How's the new web? What do you guys think about the new webcam? I'm kind of looking this way all the time now, though, versus versus like. I mean, it could always go like, boom. I'll make it through. All right. All right, I think we're done with the overlay, though. I can probably export it now. Oh, yo, before I export anything, actually, let me go into project settings. There we go. My overlay up. Where's the overlay? Should should be seeing it now. Uh. Oh shit! Wait, I just realized I'm like. Hmm. What should we do about that? Where's chat overlay? It's on the bottom for some reason. Here, I can move it. There we go. Um. Here, wait, I want to do one more thing with our camera here. Ah, uh, the only issue with my camera is that it's like, see them getting cut off here. So uh, what I have to do is like, I can put myself here. Uh, or I can tilt the camera upwards. Or I can put myself underneath. I see. I can put myself underneath my overlay. Um, let me see which one's better. Oh, but then I won't be on my chat, on top of my chat. But actually, I think it might be okay if we use this webcam. Let me see. So yeah, we can do that. How tall are you? 5'7". Mm -hmm. Let me get my, let's get YouTube up here. Mm -hmm. 
But yeah, we have a leaderboard now. Check it out. It's all on the site. So if you ever want to see who's uh, how many bow ties do you have? Um, exactly seven. Wait, we got points. Drink, drink, drink. Wait. Uh, I think it's <laughs> Tober. I think it's broken. Wait, let me see. I think the the fix broke it. Are they labeled Monday to Sunday? Um, no, they're not. They're only, I only wear, honestly, I have seven, but I only wear like three. I wear the red one, the yellow one, and then maybe the black one sometimes. It's all sorted by total points. Let's see. Yeah, let's see, like, adios. Yeah, I've never, yeah, it's redeemed, it's by total points. How's it going, also, how's it going, Kubi man? Okay, oh, let me bring this chat out. Is this Animal Crossing? Uh, no, this is, uh, I forget what it's called, that cat game? Mm -mm -mm. What's the lore behind the bow ties? Um, I can make up a story or I can tell you the boring truth. There's no lore behind the bow ties. All right, so what do we want to do today? So we're supposed to release a playtest today. That's what that's what the the title says. Why do we never see a necktie? You want a necktie, Kubi man? I can get you a necktie. Um, but if I want if I wear a necktie, I'll have to watch a YouTube video again. Probably. Let me see. Let me just grab it behind the uh, the uh, Kermit over here. All right. Which one do you want? You want, uh, we can wear this one. We can wear this, uh, British looking one since it's, uh, July 5th. We can wear this one. We can wear this red one. Maybe instead of our, our red one, we can wear this purple one. Maybe what do you think? We got this. Why is July 5th? British, because July Fourth is uh, Independence Day for us Americans. Americans, purple one or the red one? I'll shoot this side, whichever one you want. I'll just put them all like this. Huh? Uh, why is it? Ah, just to be fair. Just being trying to be trying to be fair. Or I could just wear them all like this. Neckties. All right.
Alright. Oh, I should do one more command or one more notification on the bottom for leaderboard. Yeah, let's do that real quick too. Did I throw it under here? I forgot. I think we're still using this, if I'm not mistaken. So here, let's just do this. I think it's actually fixed now. All right. You change the camera angle? Maybe. Maybe. Okay, um, should we do one final play test? Um, we'll do one, one final play test, and then we're also going to... Um, we have to run our whole resource manager thing again, uh, and I think it'll be ready. Should we reset the leaderboard? I, I forgot how to reset the leaderboard. Oh, yeah, we have to go on... Oh, shit, Tomer, I just realized. Hmm, I wonder if it's dangerous, though, to send the, send the leaderboard data to the website. Captain Coder. I'd say another server. Okay. How's it going, Captain? Hope your uh, hope your dog is okay now. Now that the fireworks are over. Although they seem to usually, at least where I live, fireworks tend to stick around for like another two weeks or so. Sporadically. get any more tonight yeah it's usually what happens at least where i live mm -mm -mm. can totally do that yeah it would be cool too uh but yeah i think that's pretty uh, yeah we'll talk about that another time but yeah you said it works like uh did you merge it already too uh 
They're legal, so hoping they won't last too long. I see. It is a totally safe thing of directly working on the West IC. Um, looks good. I should delete myself. I should delete my points. It's like I'm tooting my own horn here. Here, you know what? Um, said that impractical only has one point. You know what it could technically do? If I do this uh, first, if I do add points, I'm pretty sure this will work or it'll break everything. Add points uh, first or uh, practical NPC uh, first. And then I grab this and I just set this to negative this value. I'm pretty sure this should work. So when it updates, hopefully we'll have zero points. Oh, it worked immediately. Uh, points is, yeah, points is uh, from real internet, from, I should turn everything off from stream elements. So the website updates in real time now. Nice. Oh, I see. Cool. What's the difference between the fake ones and the real ones? Hmm. I think... You know, it's, I think the real, the fake ones are actually more real than the fake, uh, yeah, the fake ones are more real than the real ones. The fips and the rips. Wait, why is my, why is my text on the bottom again? Did we redo, oh, here we, there we go. You have, uh, whoa, you have 197k fake ones. That's worth, that's worth about $10. 198k. Redeems. Commands. Here, let's remove everything from stream elements. Chat commands. Anything that we don't need, like... That commands is okay. Uh, give points, leaderboard, points. All right, I think that's good. Hey, Prack, how's it going, Will Time? Okay. Any other commands we want to add? So yeah, the command for for the leaderboard is just the I mean it just links you to the site. Uh
Oh wait, so maybe I should update that. It doesn't update every 30 minutes now. Right? Mm -hmm. All right, let me, I'll update that real quick too. I'll have to re reload the, the, um, maybe I, I should make a script that like reloads any files too, but right now I have to just do it manually. Mm, 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 mm. Okay. All right, let's play test the game so we can get this demo out already. Or this play test, I mean. We also have people, um, not every, uh, we'll update the list, because I'm sure we got more people added to the, uh, to the tombstones. Oh, shit, I should have asked people if they wanted, a, like, a specific tombstone in the survey. Um, I'll, I'll probably just make a Discord announcement about that. Rip. Specifically for Captain, I have to make a, I have to make like a, a giant, a giant, uh, statue. I'll probably, I'll probably get someone to, I'll probably commission someone to do it actually. Don't forget, you, you haven't told me what you want, Tomer. Yeah, I know you like, I remember you said you were cool with the tombstone, but you can also you you definitely can have a statue too. And I think anyone who has a statue will also get the tombstone as well. We said that you'll decide what. Oh, okay, okay, all right. I forgot. I forgot. I said that. Can I have eighteen? You can. You want eighteen hats? That'd be actually pretty funny. Like a giant captain. I can totally see it as like a. Well, actually. Oh my goodness. We dropped the chat. Oh my god, I keep forgetting we have to fix that. There we go. We, uh, so I was working on that last night. We streamed for like 14 hours last night. Um, and by the end of the stream, I was dead, so I abandoned. I abandoned the, uh, the, the differences in chat. What I wanted to do, and I, I mean, we still have it technically working. Oh shit. Uh, like if you look here. Like, this technically works. Like, we, we have this working. Um, but what I wanted to do is, like, we set a limit. Oh, my God. Um, I set a limit to the size of that one. So, you know, it's only, like, maybe four, four or five messages. But in this one, it's, like, unlimited. Uh, but the thing is, if I press the button to show it, I think it breaks. We might even crash. I'm not even going to try it. Um, but I wanted to show all of the previous messages, too, so we can look at the history. So it looks like, you know, people are, are active in the chat. Mm -mm, mm -mm. It looks like I'm staring at it. I mean, we could leave it there, but I kind of like it in its current spot. I, I guess for playtesting, it's kind of nice, though, right? Wait, let me see. I mean, it's kind of nice here, right, while we playtest? And it does look I'm like, it does look like I'm kind of looking at it, right? Is it? How's it going? How's it going, Daniel Pancake? Psh, psh. One of my message did messages did not show up. Uh, let me see. Like when I when I moved it. Seems like it's right.
There we go. Actually, bring it back down there. But yeah, we'll fix it at some point uh, the next time we do an overlay dev stream. And possibly, we might even do it today. We'll see. <laughs> um, we should have... Wait, wait. Uh, who got first today? Uh, we keep resetting it. Shit. Um, if you had first, I'm pretty sure it would give you, like... Let me see. I I'm pretty sure I should have first, actually. Hello? Yeah, I have first right now. By default, I have first, but... Um, you get, you get an icon add, added to your name too. Daniel Pancake, if you had most redeems for posture, uh, you would get a, a bone icon next to your name. Uh, I, I think we kind of abandoned that part of the pro. I think we did first, second, and third, but we didn't finish, uh, adding all of the other commands. Um, how we'll probably do it is like whoever has the most redeems for that command uh, during the stream, they'll they'll have that. The icons only appear on the overlay. Yeah, I don't, I don't think it would be possible for me to add it to uh, chat. Mm -mm -mm. But you can use BB code on the chat. So if you want to add any images, or well, you can only add images that are in my in the project wasn't some cool way i wish that would be pretty cool oh shit we have to do i think we have to actually do 40 push-ups now all right i'm pretty sure i've played through all of this we can actually ignore everything here uh Yeah, I'm pretty sure we played through everything and there were no bugs. If there's going to be a bug, it's going to be on Chapter 3. So actually, let's just play through Chapter 3. Uh, let's you modify the actual... Uh, uh, the the actual HTML of the, of the... The HTML of the actual Twitch page. I think it's limited to the video. Yeah, you shared that with me at some point, right? Like the... Uh, Yeah, you can you can do that. You can mess with the image size. I wonder if you make it like really large. I wonder if you can like break break the the overlay. Like nine 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 or like the largest. What's the largest? Uh, you can make it larger actually. Oh, it gets cut off. Ah, uh, that's good actually. Uh, I'm glad. I'm glad it gets cut off and doesn't cover the screen. Oh my god, I'm so bad right now. Here, let me turn off. Good dose, Grieber. If you do, actually, yeah, there's like some, there are some images that you can add, like the heart or something, but there's a, an actual path for that that I don't know right now. I do want to work on the overlay a little bit more later. Maybe if we can finish this demo, um, maybe I'll do overlay dev. Or, I don't know. We'll see. Um, it'd be also kind of fun to maybe play video games, too. It's been so long since I've played video games. But yeah, a bunch of hats on Captain Coder's um, statue would be really cool too. And and a hat skin would be kind of cool too, like a bunch of hats. Oh shit! Wait, where do I go from here? Oh, 
almost looked like maybe but i mean i think considering how many hours i have in the game i don't think i'm that good but that's okay it, it makes play testing a lot better for me when i'm not that good at my own game Meet a bus. How's it going? I'm ready to work. Uh, looks like you had a real productive day yesterday. We we started strong for sure. Uh, towards the end, I mean, we still made a lot of progress. Towards the end, it was kind of, kind of weird, but we, yeah, we we got stuff done. It's good. Um, but uh, hope you have a good day. Good day at work, though. There's a bug with the eyeball enemies. Um, that I'm too lazy to fix right now. Hello, how's it going? How's it going, pros? Uh, give it another step. I finally created the main menu for the game. Hell yeah. Awesome. Are you pros? Do you stream? Have you been streaming? Oh, I didn't know you streamed. Let me give you a let me give you a follow. We'll go on in four hours. Nice. Okay. We'll see. I'm not sure how long I'm going to stream today. Again, we did a four, 14 hour stream yesterday. So like, I don't know. Um, I don't know if I'll, maybe, maybe I'll be tired. We'll see. I, I did dread starting the stream today though. Not going to lie. It took me a hot minute. It, it took me a hot minute to like get up and everything. But if I do end my stream and you're on, um, I'll check you out. Maybe we'll, we'll, perhaps we'll even raid you. But I, I, again, I don't know how long I'm going to stream. It could be, we could do another 14 hour stream. Who knows? I will say, even though it was exhausting yesterday, it was a lot of fun. Yesterday was a really fun stream. I think splitting, honestly, splitting, uh, game, the stream into, uh, game dev and then, and then overlay dev made made it so much more bearable. Made like sitting in front of a computer for you know fourteen hours more bearable. Captain Onosa, thanks for the raid. How's it going? How is uh porting over to uh GD script switching going from uh oh Mathroom is on. Mm -mm -mm. Oh dude, I, for I I forgot we we started the stream so late today. Uh slash shout out Captain. Oh, I'm trying to shout out Captain Onosa. I think someone did it before me. How's it going, everybody? Fody, Fody, Game Dev, uh, blah, 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 blah. who else is here? Serenity, welcome back. Practical is such a, uh, what is that? What is that? I, I'm, I'm the one who made it. I forgot what the, the name is for that. Chado. Mm -mm 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 -mm. 
I'm not affiliated with the raid, but I'm here too. Welcome CSLR. How's it going? So many captains to follow these days. Captain Onosa, Captain uh Captain Coder, Captain Commerce. Um who else? Are we lagging? I don't know if it's because it's getting super hot, but my computer, I feel like my computer, I can't even watch people. I feel like I can't even watch people's streams anymore. Like while I'm, while I'm simultaneously streaming, I have to like, maybe I have to open up my second, uh, computer and like run stuff on there, which honestly is probably a better idea. Captain Serenity Games. Maybe there there should be a captain crew. Get non non raid. How's it going, Adagon? Oh, did did you get added to our captain uh, our our raid count? Captain Anosa just raided with five viewers. Does it say? Oh yeah, Captain Anosa raided one times. Nice. Captain, you, you've been uh, you've been added to uh, our leaderboard. We have a leaderboard now. You can check it out here. Uh, we don't show the raid counts just yet. But all of the uh, channel rewards are there. I should copy that into the stream deck so I don't have to type it out all the time. Uh, let me do that real quick. Must win the leaderboard. Let me, uh, uh, Adagon is, is in the lead for raids. What should we, what should we do for a leaderboard? Let me see. Is there an icon? Honestly, there's never going to be a list. A list would be good, right? Just a random list, but there aren't any. Uh, uh, can we find... Oh, here we go. Okay, let's just see. Oh, right here. I wish you can change the color. Easy first place. A raid is a raid. You get a shout out. Yeah, I think what we'll do is... Captain Osa, thanks for the prime. Really appreciate it. Mm -hmm. I think the moving boulders should have more contrast kind of hard to see especially with the spikes i see um yeah i i kind of agree actually um they are definitely uh they are placeholders um but yeah at some point i want i think i'll want to replace them and joe game dev thank you thank you as well for the sub really appreciate it Thanks. Oh shit. I'm gonna get a train going. Oh, that's another thing. Like, so there's so many things you can do with the also shout out to Kenny Dev for making the uh the Godot plugin. It's really good. Uh, I've barely scratched the surface with it, um, and yeah, it's really, it's made my life so much easier. Doesn't cap, uh, pirate software? Yeah, I think so. I believe so. Kenny Dev is awesome. Yeah. I don't interact with much, uh, I don't interact with him much, but 
yeah, what they made was awesome. 104, yeah. I think we were we were live uh at least yeah i was live i think when we were i i don't think i saw the end of it but i remember i remember being live and seeing that it was kind of kind of crazy Mm -hmm. oh, oh. yeah there's this weird bug on our on some of our eyes where like they don't i think yeah i'm not entirely sure what's happening but they're like invisible and no sounds play either uh it's a new recent bug um i want to fix it but i'm kind of lazy Yeah, also, I, there's a bug here, too, where we hear the sound way before um, we enter the room. I'm not sure why that's happening, either. We must have the hitbox of the... Um, I know, uh, what's his name is in there. Uh, Hellraiser is in that... In the scene afterwards but maybe the hitbox is like moved also tomer do you, do you have any idea of like what you would want in a statue um like something i mean yeah we can do anything but if you have anything in particular that you're interested in so i have an idea A f uh, floating, rotating, glowing triangle. I could do that with some particles drawn toward. I could do something like that. I, I think it could make it look really cool too. And I'll add like a plaque to it too. Hmm, when I I should do a stream when I'm specifically doing like everyone uh like statues and and uh oh actually I messaged uh maybe maybe I can ask um someone from the someone from the art competition uh actually made some tombstones and maybe I can ask them to make all of the tombstones including the uh the statues as well Uh, it's a thing for my game, but I won't. Oh, okay. I thought it had to do with like, uh, your engine or like, yeah. Cause like, isn't like, I don't know anything about Vulcan, but like, I keep hearing like, it's all triangles or something like that. Something related to triangles. Engine icon is a light bulb. Okay. Mm -mm 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 -mm.
Mm-hmm. This this section looks so boring now because there's no um no fog. Um but I'll I'll fix it after the release. Uh, I want to completely redo the fog. So, this part's a little challenging, let's see. I think we updated the respawn rate of the eyes, and now it's, now it's difficult. I can't get past it. I have to like fuck. Oh my god. Let me see. What the hell? I did it before. There we go. All right, there we go. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. So yeah, I think the demo is good. We have to mess with some of the files to like remove anything, like any audio files and stuff like that. But all in all, everything else should be fine. Um. Everything in graphics is triangles. I see. Um, the next revision of my engine will use uh, Vulcan, currently using OpenGL. I see. Okay. All right. I should do these push ups. We have to do 40. Right, I'm going to take off these ties. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Probably clean some bugs along the way too. Okay. Oh, I can't breathe. What is this? Uh, four stash box. Bunch of random get nodes that don't exist anymore. Let's see. That's a lot of this one. What's this? Should we just run this and then check everything? Let's see. Hey, wait, before we do this, let's commit. Also, I'm going to try something with our audio real quick. Instead of using this noise suppression, I'm going to use just regular. How do I sound? Uh, wait, let me, let me try this out real quick. You guys are probably going to hear me twice. Oh, actually, maybe not. Let me try this. If I mute my audio. Wait, first, let me see. Go into advanced audio. And go into uh, I think I just prefer this. Oh, right now, prefer this. Okay. Alrighty. Um, not found. Let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of this. Spikes right. Let's see if that's everything. Oh, we have no music. Oh, shit. I thought they said that this doesn't 
So it's there, right? There we go. Right, it's saying uh, node not found. Uh, is it maybe this is a different script? Moving stone block. Oh, we we don't run this anymore. That's interesting. I'm pretty sure we don't run this anymore. No. All right. Well, uh, no errors now, so I think we're good. Oh, I just realized you don't even need that that uh that portal. There might be a faster way to get through the game, maybe. Okay. Anywho, um, let me see what else we got left here. Audio resource manager, and I think that's it. All right. Oh, there's gonna be so much work though. I already forgot how we did this originally. Um, let me see. Resource. Probably had something called a resource manager. Editor resource manager, scene resource database. Uh, what is this? I don't think we use this anymore. Variable resource to check, though. I forgot what it was called. Shit. It's probably singleton though, so let's just go. Or honestly, wait, let me just check our model out here. Scene resource checker. Scene 
scene resource checker. All right. So I don't remember how we run this tool in general. Um, like if we have to run it outside of, uh, let me see. Current room's clear. Database. A Discord off chat. That's pretty cool. And that's what's happening right next to you. Nice. That's pretty cool. Are you going to join in? Yeah, how's it going, Yasfo? I'm at work. Sounds like excuses to me. All right. Yeah, I don't remember how we ran this script. It probably has to do with the scene resource database, though. Let me see. Uh... File system manager. Oh, yeah, we had something called a file system manager as well. Let's see. Oh, shit. That, that's broken. But you can do... You can do exclamation TTS. Oh, yeah, I should probably connect that. Here, let me remove that TTS for now. I'll give you back your points, too. It's free until it, it, it annoys me. And then I'll probably make it not free. Yeah, like that. But I do have a button to pause it or to stop it. So maybe it'll never annoy me. Yeah. It's quieter than the music. True. It's based on, we can set it to a, a higher volume. You got a Home Depot tab? Yeah, I do. I have a Home Depot. I have a... Uh, I can show you my stream deck. Here. I mean, this is for... A Home Depot command? No, but we have everything for, like, push-ups uh sessions this is only for the overlay though and then we have obviously everything else zoom where's my other one? Oh, these why don't these work oh, yeah Tis, wake up. Uh, 
It's fractical NPC. Okay. Uh, I wanted to. I need to set this as a as a as a link here. It's kind of annoying to always open it. Uh, stream manager. Recommended. Get rejected. Okay. Um, what was I going to do? I was going to remove that command too. Okay. Um all right, so I don't remember how we run this tool. Uh, scene resource checker. I assume it's that scene resource checker. Um, so uh, do we run this on the room? I think we instance the game though, don't we? Get resources on input route. So yeah, the scene resource checker. When are we running this? Or where where is this in our game? Scene resource checker. Is this in our uh let me see something? <gasps> is it is it in our Oh, it is. We just have it on the ready function. Um, but no, we don't want to run it right here. We want to run it like on the main scene. Um, I'm surprised we don't see it anywhere here though. So we want to put it in our world, our world script, I believe. Or actually, technically we want it in our sounds node as well. Uh, on input node, get resources on the input node. Um, input root. Well, input root is going to grab everything. How do we know their input? Get all data. So if it's not a debug build or run tool is not is equal to false, then we return. Oh, I see. Okay. So we just say run tool here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Uh, by default, we should set this to false. Oh, Camilus, I, I gotta make you the, I gotta give you the hydrate, the hydrate thing. Um, so I'm pretty sure you have the hydrates. Should I do that first? But I don't want to work on the overlay, right? I shouldn't work on the overlay because it's it's a never ending battle. So you should have a. Here, wait, maybe I can. Who has the most? Po uh, actually, we could check this out right now. Check it out. Where's where did I put the command? Right here. Wait, what is this song? Maniac. Who has the most uh, push ups? Or not push ups, uh, posture checks? Camilo's? Oh, I thought it was, I thought it was Daniel Pancake. Oh my god, Camilus. Oh, Daniel Kapanke has 69, though. This is a banger remix. It is a banger remix. 20,000 points on just hydrates. Basically. Let me see. Who spent the most points? Anyone who has uh, VIP spent the most points. Uh, 
Oh, Amida bus? I have to remove 160k from them, though. I have VIP? True, you actually do. Here, you know what? Here, Tomer. Add points. Uh, Tomer bar. Uh, what is VIP? What, what is the command? Get VIP badge. Uh, do I have to put it in quotes? Shit, I don't think we... I don't know what's gonna happen here. If I give... I, if I give... I don't know if I put it in quotes. Here, I guess we'll find out. And you'll refund. No, um, that's not what I'm concerned with. It's, uh, if I give you the VIP, like if I record it, I was going to give you the points for VIP. I'm just worried it's going to, oh, but yeah, I could refund you. Yeah, that works too, actually. Yeah, do it. I just realized, yeah, that works too. Because we don't have refunds. Um, imagine how scary it would be. Can, you can refund yourself, I'm pretty sure. Just make sure you reject. Don't <laughs> don't complete. I'm pretty sure you can do it. Can you do it? All right, you want me to do it? I can do it. I'll try to. All right, let me know if it doesn't work. Dude, I keep forgetting what this uh, stream... It's called. Stream manager. Here we go. Let me let me favorite this. Put this on their Twitch. Okay, nice. Yeah, now you have it. There you go. And I have to give Amida Bus. I think Amida Bus, I have to remove uh, one VIP. Maniac. Nice. Yeah, we should have a most 69s. 69 count. I'm curious. Nithir, yeah, Nithir runs this the most. I have the most VIP badges. Pandacoder has the most puss ups. Nithir has the most hello there's. Adagon second. Oh. Pigorly again. It. JD has more Pigorlis than Pigorli. TTS Pigorli, not surprised there. Tober has the most firsts. Camilus most seconds. Promax has the most thirds. Pandacoder, Adagon. Nothing better to do. Of course, Yag's going to have this one. No one likes to say adios. Speedrun attempt. Pentacoder asked for a speedrun attempt. Wahoo! No one runs this anymore. Hey, I think I'll remove this one since no one runs it. And now for something completely different. Yeah, these no one runs these two. I'll probably get rid of them. Free copy of memory. Adios is costly. I see. I didn't even notice. How much is it? 500? It is 500. It's pretty loud, though. I think that's... And your name in the credits. Yeah, we, we increased the price for name and credits. 
Yeah, I'll re I'm going to remove the uh, Wahoo. Wahoo and uh, completely different. And honestly, Audios. I'll probably remove that one too, maybe. Since no, I don't think anyone really... Uh, some people do. Everyone likes the Hello There's, though. Hello There's and Drinks. And... Trying to save points for the name. Nice. Mm, 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 mm. Trying to save. Yeah. Are you really? It doesn't seem like you're trying to save. It might take two years, but memory probably won't be yet. Yeah, maybe, maybe. All right. Um, all right. I need to. Oh, we we need to we need to wake up, dude. I think I'm just I'm still exhausted from yesterday. All right. In some parallel universe, Memori was released seven months ago. One said Memori will release in 20, January 2024. Hmm. Well... Technically, maybe it did release. Maybe, was there a demo? Probably a demo release. Do I have a date for the deadline for the playtest build? Yeah, today. That's the date. Well, actually... Yeah, today. Honestly, yesterday at this point. Should have been yesterday. Should have been last month, actually. Okay. Um. All right. Let's close this. Should we should we talk like this? Hmm. What time do I think Spotlight Saturday will start tomorrow? Um, I woke up at 11 today, but I'm exhausted. I think I'll probably go to sleep earlier today. Maybe, perhaps. Um, so, yeah, I'm not entirely sure. Pro at least by 12, I would say. So 7 p.m. for you. Chat is waving back. Okay. So we have to run this on uh, the singleton. So yeah, we just tell our uh, our node to run on get tree. Get all data. Same scene. Uh, scene name. What's the scene name? Okay. 
Yeah, all data. Entered scenes. What's entered scenes? Fuck, what the hell is this? I forgot what I wrote here. Entered scenes has seen. What the hell are our entered scenes? Um, um, um. Yeah, I'm not sure what the scene name is. Uh, I assume I assume it's just the the root node or our uh, chapter our main scene perhaps entered scene is equal to the scene name it could be the main scene actually our main scene doesn't have any audio in it so maybe it's fine but I think we'll want to grab it from the main scene anyway so yeah let's do it in the main scene not sure if it's going to crash anything. Uh, let's also reset any data. Uh, if reset data. Here, let's, let's run this real quick, too. Oh, we do run this on the, um, on the world. So we have to grab the rooms node. Let's go into chapter one. What's up? Oh shit, we already have it here. Look at that. Why didn't I see this in our script? Ah. You know, it's interesting. We're running this all the time. No shit. Oh, uh, I wonder if our game was slow because of this. Probably. We're like iterating through every room, checking for resources. Oh. In the overlay chat. Is Russian broken? It is broken, huh? Is it just yours? Is it your normal text or is it just... Is it because of your keyboard or something? Mm -hmm. Cyrillic? Oh, I see. What did it say for this? Oh, it works. I didn't know it would work because I have a custom font on it. But I guess because it's rich, a rich, te rich text label. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, boom, boom. 
You can do one font size one. Oh, what the hell? Where'd my check go? I lost it. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Was it what does that mean? All you Russian Cyrillic Polish speakers Unity. What speakers? So impractical. Okay. So close. Okay. All right. No more. No more. So like, I wonder if it messes with the the stream. Like, people are gonna think I'm a Russian streamer now. Not that there's anything wrong with that. But I'll leave the Russian streams to Daniel Pancake. Russians. Try Chinese. Polski, Polski, Polski. Ryan, how's it going? Buenas tardes, Buenas tardes. All right. Um, so I think this works. Um, let's go, let's go back into our scene resource. Checker. Run tool. Reset data. Don't reset data. Actually. 
uh yeah don't reset data but i think we want to reset this data i don't remember i'm gonna reset everything though how the hell do you clear this though i just set it to zero current audio there we go Will Hebrew work? I mean, yeah, everything will work. Okay, so we grabbed chapter three. All right, so we see 600, wait, what? It's broken again, fuck. Let me see. Current resource variables. Wait, actually, no, these are correct, technically. And then the current room names. Current room names is wrong, though. Unless it could be a visual bug. Let me see. It works if you use actual emotes, like not from Twitch. You can set it set it there, but Twitch will not work. I lied. I thought it worked yesterday. Oh, because that's t still technically a Twitch emote. That's why. so yeah why are we we're grabbing the wrong rooms let me see rooms room names get used rooms scene resource database dot current room dot append are we saving the rooms here do we see rooms let me see I see footdos.tscn. So these are. What the hell? Yeah, everything seems to get appended for some reason. Current room names.append. That's so weird. Uh, let me see. Current audio. Yeah, it's so weird. I think it's a bug. Um, and I'm not entirely sure why. Let me see. They're all they're they're all unique. It's like saving them. Hmm. Let me close it and then run it again. Although the database we have to clean. Okay. Okay. 
Mixor Studio. How's it going? Oh, that sound too slow. Hello there. Welcome. How you doing today? Um, hopefully we fixed it. Moment of truth. Please work. Yeah, dude. What the hell? And, and it's a different amount of information, too. That is so weird. Let me reload the project for a quick second. I remember this being a bug earlier, though, too. Uthar. Uh, Jason Hell. Something like that. Oh, you know what, though? Wait, what the hell? That's so weird, because when we print it out, it is in correct order, though. Like, we see all the rooms. Huh. You know, honestly, low-key don't even care. I don't care that, they, that they're all the same array. They could be all in the same array. It actually doesn't matter to me. gotta fly hope you're uh, hope all is going well thank you um <sighs> with hell we've already been streaming for almost two hours it's kind of crazy Yeah, I'm not sure why, though. Like, everything should be split up correctly. Uh, wait, let me see something. Yeah, so weird. So freaking weird. Why don't you want to wait? I did. We waited until like one twenty yesterday. Um, I'm not entirely sure why the hell. Like, I'm definitely not. I mean, look at this. Look at this again.
Do, 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 do. What does this get all Reese? Oh, we. I see. I wonder if there's an issue with like. Because we're grabbing so many resources simultaneously, maybe. Maybe it freaks something out. Check audio resource. Here, let me try something. Let me just get the current variable resources. Yeah, let me comment this out. Let me just get the audio and let's reset everything. Okay. We re reload this. Look at our scene here. We see 129, and they all get at. Yeah, uh, something is wrong here. Something is broken. Save resources. Wonder why. Maybe I have to save it as a resource node? Let me see. Or you know what? Let me let me try removing this tool script. You know what's weird? Why does it say 130 versus 129? So it didn't seem like that made a difference. Uh, let me say extends resource. I think we could still have this. Psych. I wonder if it's because it's a child. Assigned expressions type. No, it doesn't match resource. How do we... Yeah, maybe that's why. All right. That's weird. We're we're clearing everything here. Um, uh, see, scene resource database. Let's see if that works. Uh, can't be instance as a node here. Let's get rid of this.
Is there an error saving this? It's still saving as a... What the hell, bro? Is it because it's a tool? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't know why the hell. It, it saves everything under the same name. I, it can't be. Okay, check audio resource. We don't have it. We append it to this node. Let me look this up. This has to be a bug. I guess we could just run it like it doesn't really make a difference like we, we can run it the same way it's just so odd all right let me comment this out for a second let me see because all i'm doing is appending to this here let me let me see if i don't do this then like nothing else happens Unless maybe there's some something else somewhere else. Okay, so there's less. 
So that means something is uh, something else is being called somewhere. Um, but it's again, it's still being called in these nodes. Let me see. So where could we? Uh, where else? You know what I'm saying. Get rid of this. Okay, current variable resources. Um, current resource valuables. <laughs> Here, let me comment this one out. Current resource variables. And then what's this? Get resources. Wait, instance res wait, what the hell is this? Instant resource nodes. Get resources and an instant resources nodes. Instance resource nodes. Oh, okay. We're gonna comment this out for a second. I think when we're grabbing the resource nodes, maybe that breaks is it breaks it. Uh because yeah, maybe resource nodes are stored somewhere in our game. If I had to guess. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Five hundred and thirty? What the hell? Holy shit, yeah, what the hell are we doing? I feel like I need to rewrite this whole thing. Oh, uh, the other issue though is that I don't think we're clearing everything. No, we are clearing. Hmm. I think we can keep it as a scene. Uh, whether or not it's a resource doesn't matter. But I, th I think we have to clean something up. Something is broken here. Let me grab what we did before. Honestly, let me go back and get up and just clear everything. Uh, oh, we fixed some... Did we fix some stuff with our... Oh, fuck. All right, whatever. I want, I want to do that. Anything with our resource manager, let's discard. Okay. 
Okay. Let me see. There we go. Okay, wait, wait, wait. 101, okay. Um Bro, is there I think there's a there's a gremlin mic in my computer. Why the hell does it work now? I didn't I didn't I didn't even undo anything. All right. So we see this node um, right now in our ready function. You know, it's weird. I think our ready function, we're clearing everything from these nodes. All right. So this looks about correct. Uh, this looks correct now. Um, I don't know why the hell it didn't work earlier. Let me run it one more time. Uh, wait, do we always have to run this? Let me see. Okay. All right, this looks correct. The resource variables, um, current resource variables. This is everything, including audio, I assume. Uh, and then current room nodes is 60. All right. I wonder if we have to play through the game at all. I don't remember if that was a thing. I don't think so. Um, everything is ran on the first frame. All right. Try to do these push ups.
Uh, get used rooms. Where do we grab our... We also have something called a file manager. File system manager. Um, edited resourcer, resource database, and also editor data. I don't know what the hell this is, but this is what we need. Well, I guess editor data is from the manager. And then we compare the two. Let me see. Mm hmm or it seems like we don't even use it. Okay. So the file system manager, uh, print data, file check, uh, get all directories, run comparison. Seems like we, we wrote it all here though. So run compare file. So we print all the data that currently exists. Where's the, uh, where do we grab the files? Run file check. And then we print the data. Okay. I'm probably going to reset all of this information. Um, so here. We ran it on chapter one. Let's run it on chapter two. Uh, the only thing right now, though, is on the ready function. I think we're clearing everything. We shouldn't do that. I don't think. So here, let's go back. Uh, on the yeah, on the ready, we're clearing. Let's get rid of this. Whoops. Unless we wanted to reset data, but I don't think we care for that just yet. <sighs> okay, so we reload. Oh, uh, actually, this is going to break on us, I'm pretty sure, because... Bum, bum. We're not, it's not going to break, but we're going to get double information, right? Oh, wait, no. Okay. Um, fuck it. I'm going to try. I'm going to reset everything, though, one last time. Uh, and we'll do it. I I'm not sure if we have to, if it checks if it already exists. It probably does, actually. We probably have that working. Um, I haven't touched this script in a hot minute, though. So we load in. Uh, let's go into the main menu. Start going to chapter two. Technically, we should go into chapter one at uh, prologue, but prologue doesn't have anything yet. Okay. Oh, I wonder if... Um, I guess we are checking for resources on these tex textures, too. I wonder if that works. Well, I guess we'll find out when we run the game. Um, and let's do chapter three. Okay. Uh, let's reload. Um, and we should... Oh my god, bro. It's happening again. 718 files again. Like, they're all... I don't know what the hell is going on there. Um, but maybe it doesn't matter. Honestly, it might not even matter. Because all we need is the resource variables. If the resource, if they, if these are all the files, I don't know why it's it's it's. Let me see something. Boom 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 boom. Mm -hmm, mm -mm -mm. We're running it on the title screen. This is a jam. It is a jam. Flesh opera. Um, okay. Scene root, title screen menu. Yeah. Um, and we run it in the credit scene as well. Um, all right. Let's just, let's just keep it, I guess. 
Um, we'll, we'll mess with it this way. So there are 700 and what, 12 resource files. Uh, let me just make sure this is everything. So like, it, it, yeah, includes audio files. Mm -mm. All right. So let's go into our file system manager now. And I think I have a script that checks, that goes through all of our, let me see, clear previous data. Uh, sure. All files. All right, run file check. Oh, wait, let's clear this too. Okay, I think it worked. Let's reload the scene here. Um, run compare files, run. Let's clear, clear previous data. Uh, apparently we don't even run this anymore. Okay, so run file check. Uh, and run audio check. Hmm. I don't know why, but we're not even seeing anything. Let me see. It's printing. Oh, there we go. There we go. Um, it took a hot minute. So, you know what? Let me refresh everything because I'm not sure if we if we run it multiple times. I wonder if it... Oh, why, why is the size not updating here? Let's set this to zero too. Okay, let me run it one more time. Um, and then print data. It says zero. Run file, audio file? Here, wait. Print database. Um, if not run, sure. Um, and it says we should be, wait, let me see. Run file check. Yeah, it's not working. What the hell? Database, this. Yeah. No, this is printing. Shit. Okay, let me, I guess. Variables to remove all directories. Huh. Let me reload the project. Is the playtest going to be public? Um, so it's it's going to be private right now. It's for backers, specific backer tiers. And then once we get that and like we get all the playtests done with that, then we'll we'll see about the public playtest. Well, actually, yeah. So there's like three steps to all of this. It's the the private playtest, then the uh ba full backer playtest, and then the public playtest. Is how I'm gonna go about it. Um, where were we? So yeah, let me just run this again. What do we, what do we call this? File manager, file system manager. <laughs> Yeah, it, it seems like it, it grabs the, it shows the info here. Uh, I don't know why it doesn't load the information correctly right away. It didn't even print anything either. But okay, so we have 734 audio files in our system. Let me let me run this again. Oh, it prints now. Um, invalid call, non-existent function, get file count in base nil. Uh, and then line 30, 134. Let's see for file index and input directory oh i see if it's uh get files in input directory i guess we should say the in if the input directory is not valid and then what's 134 or oh, 49 
Okay. But yeah, it seems like it's working now. Let's run this again. I don't want to get any errors though. I refresh everything, run file check. Oh my god. And then it doesn't work again. I have to like re <laughs> every time we want this to work, we have to like reload the project. Oh, but there we go. I see it now. Don't see. Huh. It prints on the ready function? Do we have a ready function? No, that's so weird. Is there a ready function in one of these? Uh, if editor hint. Oh, we are printing stuff in here. Um, what is this? Editor data. I don't, this. Ah, I don't care for this right now. Your face is already function. All right, run, run file check. It's a tool script. Run audio file check. That's so weird that it doesn't print anything. I wonder why. And then run print data. But I bet if I save this and I close it, it'll show us. There we go. <laughs> I don't know why it does that. Okay. Fuck it. All right. Let's save one at a time. Let me let me run file check first. Save it. Close it. Bring it back. And run file check gives us gives us directories, and it says room names, and all of these are empty too. It gives us all the directories. Bro, I think, you know, maybe it might be, it might have been GitHub, actually. Let me try this again. Maybe GitHub is messing with us. No, maybe not. Wait, wait a sec. Can we refresh this? Oh, I didn't mean to run this. Close everything. No, it's still... That's so weird, because I don't even have a ready function running anywhere. You see? Yeah, there's no ready. Is there anything else here? Uh, but if we don't have a don't run... Maybe something could be running there. That's so weird. Oh my God. Let me reload the project. Okay, so yeah, all directories is 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 saved and everything else is empty. Good. Um let me run run file check. Um it should have done its thing. Um but it didn't print anything again. Uh but let me ignore it. And I'm going to close the project or close the window. Open it again, and it see, and it, we do see our files, but they're all empty actually. Like nothing is here. Let me print it though. It could be empty, but let me see. Print data. You no, know, it seems like it's. 
uh, invalid call non-existent function ends with on editor file system directory. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, that works. Run print data all directories. Let me again reload the project. Maybe we should try this in in a different project. I don't know if it's because we have so many files in our in our file system. Invalid call function ends with all right. All right, so yeah, we see everything now. Um, well, we, okay, we see all of our directories. Let me see. Mm -mm -mm -mm. But some of them... Run print data. What's run print data? so the size what the hell and then the database data underscore base is equal to this node <gasps> i see something no it is a tool shit i don't know we had this working a while back and then i guess i don't know do i have to like rerun rewrite all of this let me see um, Oldie, how's it going? Thanks for the follow. Mm. All right, file check. All right, let's do this again. Get all directories. I guess we'll print through all of this. Mm -hmm. File system directory, clear files. Oh, we are clearing everything when we run this, so... Um, let's check to see if this works. Mm -mm -mm -mm. File check. Let me just run to get all directories first. I'll make this a second too. What the fuck? Are you happy? Okay, 
Should put this down here. All right, run get all directories. There should be an only, yeah, there should actually. So we, we are getting all the directories. That part, that part works. Getting all. Ah, uh, shit. What? Oh, yeah, we moved it here. So we got all the directories. If I refresh this, let's close everything. And get all directories. We got all, all our directories, and if we look through here, yeah, we can see, boom. Um, banning egg next time she uses that reward. Mm -hmm. Yo, how's it going, Mongolo? Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> How the hell do you have so many points? Literally 70k points spent on just sk skipping Undertale. I should have a command. I should do a command where I can see. Oh, I should do something with bad juju. I should do something where I can grab how recent. What the hell? What the hell are these icons? These uh, images. All right. Getting all categories. Um, and then here, let's go back. So here, let's comment this out then. Um, and then let's see what the hell is going on here. For file system in all file system directories, we say if the data type is a room scene, print found room scene. Let's just run that found audio file. You're having fun. I'm glad. Glad you're having fun. Here, wait, I'm curious. What if we do this? That's pretty cool.
Your eyes. Oh, there's a scroll bar right here. It's kind of broken. It's kind of jank, actually. Let me see. Oh, but it goes away after we do that. Okay, cool. Oh, I'll still want to fix it, though, at some point. Second favorite. Let's go in. Thanks for the raid. Oh my god, I'm too slow with the with the shout outs. Uh I don't think I I've I haven't followed you yet. How's it going? This is my first raid. Oh, I'm honored. Another person who didn't sanitize their rich text label. Mm. I actually like it. We we did set up something to remove, um, like font sizes. But honestly, I kind of like it. We set some stuff up so that like it doesn't break the overlay, but yeah. Um, but yeah, I'm honored to be your first raid. So, right. Also, also, how's it going, Finn? and how you doing? Oh, dude, Art Burklaus is streaming. Holy shit! I haven't Art Burklaus. I he I think he said he's gonna start streaming more often, but. Uh, Art Burklaus is an awesome streamer. Here, if you want to see that, that square. It's a beautiful square. It's hoping for a bigger square and just make it make it a bigger font size. Double it. Mm -mm. Oh, what the hell? Why did it do that, though? Try it again. Oh, yes, you me. Should I put my water? I'll put it down here. Hey, what the hell? Where'd it go? Oh, you didn't put the bracket. So how it works is, uh, I mean, we I guess we could move it up a little bit higher. But it's a scroll container, so it goes downwards, technically. Also, it won't work with uh, GIFs or anything like that. We could set it up to work with GIFs, but yeah, anything that's also Twitch related won't work. Please focus on the release. I'm trying. It's hard. Nothing is working. Dude, dude, I swear. What the hell, bro? What is going on? Um, so we have this tool called, what is it called? L -l 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 file check? No, no, whoops. Yeah, run file check. And see, what the hell is going on? It's not running whatsoever. Let's see. If not run. 
me see something. Okay, uh, then something's broken here. For uh, all file system directories, um, it's an array. So here, wait. Uh, let's see this. See, we see all the file system directories. Um, so then for file system directory in, okay, so then we say get all directories. If instance not valid, is this not valid? Not valid. Run. All right, so our files are valid. Um, output files, return output files. All right, so we see all of our output files. They're all valid. Uh, current file name is a string for file and current file directory. Uh, if the file type in file types, where are file types? Oh, uh, for data type in file types. What the hell is file types? Full string array. Oh shit, we must have. Uh, we shouldn't do this. We should probably. That's probably. Uh, that explains it. Where the hell is this? We cleared this file types. Ah, fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's not make this an export variable. That was a big mistake. I don't even know what the file types are. Uh, probably uh, room scene and audio. Um, for file keys in, wait, yeah, I don't remember what the hell this is. We could check though. I could, holy shit. That's probably why everything was, that's why when we refreshed everything, it was working. Um, let's open up GitHub again. Uh, let's see here. <laughs> All right, so we, we didn't make any updates to the script, right? So here, I'm actually just going to discard the changes on our scene. Actually, it doesn't matter. If we discard the scene, it's okay. The script stays the same. So room scene, here we go. Room scene and audio file. Let me just make that. It's equal to room. What are these? Is it a dictionary? No, it's an array. Cell. All right. I think we're good now. And then what? What the hell is this? Audit all files. We have a dictionary called all files. Um. see what's in here oh i guess these are all of our audio files okay i think this is why it, i think it broke because we we didn't save the data types so now now it should work hopefully fingers crossed run file check running file check wait Running file check. It's still not working though. 
Did I copy it correctly? Uh, but we're not getting this out output files. Uh, cause we didn't, oh, cause we erased, uh, here, wait, wait, let's bring this back. Get all directories. All right. There we go. Oh my God. Only took us a hot minute. We do have to reload the scene, I think, to like see everything. So we have the audio files. See. Uh, um. Did we run audio? Tr found audio file. Fall room file. Yeah, uh, we found the room files, but wait. Found found room scene. Um, current file name, but it doesn't show the room scenes. You see. All system directories. And all audio files are still not here, but maybe I have to reload again. So. Can you read this? It seems like it's the same. So we, we find these files and then the all files. Um, yeah, I don't know why it doesn't save, but at least we're finding them. So that's, that's good. All files dot data type. Oh, it's because it's over here. That's why we put it in this dictionary. Oh my god, we we jumped through so many hoops for all of this stuff, and half of these these uh oh I see. Okay, you know what's annoying? You can't like separate uh tool scripts. You have to like you have to create like sub tools or sub scripts in order to like separate them. It's kind of annoying. Um, but now we know. So yeah, maybe we should organize this tool script because eventually we're going to be using this. We're probably going to be using this way more often in the near future. All right, but we see all of our audio files now. Probably last test. All right, so yeah, these are all of our audio files. Uh, these are all of our room scenes, 362 room scenes. That sounds about right. <clears throat> um, all right, and now we, we should organize this a little bit though. The all files, I should throw this uh, like next to the all room files, all audio files. Like, why the hell do we not, like, throw it in here? Um, yeah, all system directories, all directories. Let me put that over there. So all directories. Right here. See, let me throw this over here. All right, cool. Um, all right, so now I guess we can say run compare files. See that? Uh, compare files.
fortunately, it's not like we remove anything. So, um, this should just work. Hopefully. Although, there we go. I think it worked. Um, current total in-game files. So we have something called current total in-game files. Um, and right now we just print them because there's no point in storing them. Uh, we're just going to copy them. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, exporting it into a, a text file wouldn't be a bad idea, though. But yeah. Okay, so for file in scene resource database, audio for, uh, uh, current in game. You know, it's weird though. We actually don't even care. We actually don't care for the current in game files. We want the output files to remove. Um, bar output files to remove and output files to remove. All right, so if we just comment all of this stuff out, I think we only need this. So here, wait, let me clear it again. And run compare files. And this looks like everything. This looks like all of our files to remove. Uh, we still have to go through, um, let me see something. I think it, yeah, it doesn't really matter. Um, so here, wait, let me see. Like for instance, room six needs to be removed. Um, and then a bunch of audio files need to be removed as well. Um, oh no, fade. I don't think fade works. Fade doesn't work. Or you have to slow down the fade. I think if you want fade to work. Okay. All right, let's run this. Uh, we have a few more files to add. Um, let me see, we have to run it in here. I guess we could just check. Um, uh, blah, 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 blah. What do we need? The resource checker. Um, Um, leaderboard, screen, title menu, leaderboard, menu, and credits. So credits, credits and leaderboard, that's it. Oh no, he's stuck. Let me see what's going on. Help, Run it, say, do it again. Come on, I don't see it. How come, how come mine didn't work? I know Adagon did it a long time ago. And credits. All right. So, okay. I think I think we should be good. Uh, I'm... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, let's run this one more time. So, oh, shit. I should have compared what the original values were to see if uh, things actually changed. But let me... We'll just check if it crashes, and that'll be our check. 
718 files. That sounds kind of right, maybe, perhaps. Uh, do we save? Let's see. Maybe we save it here. I don't think we do, though. Probably not. Okay. Uh, but fuck it. Let's just run it. Um, it's actually going to be less files, I'm pretty sure. Um, but we... How about now? Test, 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 test. Works like... Nice. I'm still getting used to this angle. I don't know if... What do you guys think about it? I could bring the camera closer, too. It looks so weird to me. Every time I look to the right, I'm like, what the hell? Who the hell's over there? Why are they looking, why are they looking that way? You like it? Where's my... Where are the executables? Ah, oh, shit. Which one was it? Private release? Nope. Uh, where did I release it? Probably... Tiny Teams? Tiny Teams. Uh, uh, good news. Tiny teams rejected my game. We dodged a bullet there. I'm glad. Uh, it seems like we crashed immediately. Wow, 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 wow. Let's see. Uh, eyeball sound preloads node. Eyeball sound. Okay. Um. Krodos. There are uh, things that were not. Um. Eyeball sounds preload node. What else? Eyeball sounds. Eyeball sounds preload manager. Um, do, you know what would be really good? 
if we had some sort of preload manager, I, I wouldn't know, like, I wouldn't know how to go, go about my preload manager, though. But we should do that pretty soon. Maybe, fuck. But, like, honestly, it's probably better for us to ignore it right now. And then work on it in the near future. In fact, it might be better for us to do. If we get this working, we, we should just remove files from, from our file system that we don't use anymore. That's probably the better approach. To be honest, I'm wondering, is there a way, uh, there's a way, you can, yeah, but it has to exist within either the user directory or the, uh, the project directory. Although maybe there's another way, maybe, I don't know. I don't know. Can you access project files through? Let me see. Can you access uh, operating system files through Godot? I'm probably right. Oh, you can. You can. Fortunately, well, I would hope I don't have any sussy wussy images on my computer. Can or can't? Uh, I don't. I don't want. I don't want to answer that question. <laughs> You can, but you'd have to run, like, you'd have to, you'd have to know the exact file name and you'd have to, add, you'd have to know the exact directory. And actually, no, uh, maybe you can't actually, uh, you can, but like not via, mm -mm 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 -mm. cause you have to access a, like a. You have to access like the operate operating system node or operating system. Yeah, the operating system node. Yeah. Yeah, you cannot. Um, all right, uh, I gotta figure out what the hell this is. Eyeball, this is something recent, recently that we added. Um, the Eyeball Sounds Preload Manager. Honestly, you know what we could do? We could just throw this in. Um, but I'm wondering why, I guess because this node gets added after. Do you have any images on your desktop? Here, you want to grab here I'll, I'll rename this to test test.png <laughs> find the steam keys oh my god imagine that'd be kind of crazy if you i don't think you could there's no way you can do that with bb code yo how's it going jack it wouldn't be it wouldn't be the user file it would be so uh when i said user i meant things in here anything that's located here <laughs>
So it's still a sandbox, yeah. You could, like, you could still grab stuff from the OS, but, like, unless I made something to check for that, it wouldn't work. Let, let, uh, let, let Ired do that. Let Ired have you, let Ired make a system so that you can access any file on his, on his computer. He'll do it. Probably. Back from three hours of lurking, I was, uh, nice. You were lurking for three hours. That's, that's awesome. All right, so we just need to create a preload. Uh, if we just create a reference to this preload, I think we should be good. I wonder why it didn't exist earlier, though. Let me see. Uh, so eyeball, eyeball sounds preload node is what we need. Uh, let me go in here. We go into our, I'm pretty sure we throw, I thought we'd throw this preload. Maybe not. Maybe we, let me see. Uh, oh, we say new. Interesting. Um, if we just create a preload to it, wait, what? Yeah, why did we make a, why didn't we just... Here, if I just do this, if I just say, uh, eyeball. Say preload. Uh, what do we call it? Eyeball sounds? Preload manager? Is that what that is? Let me see. Yeah. So we just throw this in here. Uh, inside of this, it's also a bunch of preloads. I don't remember if that works correctly, but we'll find out. Mm -hmm. Holy shit, it's already 7 o'clock. Dude, this is what happens when you wake up super late. Want to see something amazing? Of course I do. Let me see it. All right. Um, so I have to technically run this one more time. Put the test uh, in the same folder as the Godot project that's uh, running the BB text. Uh, I'm sure I can do it. Give me one second. Uh, we can do res, res, uh, the default directory in Godot, uh, icon.svg, and you'll, you'll get the Godot icon. Probably. All right, so technically this should work now if we quit and we go into... Gonna head out now. All right, see us, Laura. Have a good one. Peace. What am I seeing here? The long story of chicken influenza. Nice. Oh, dude. Yeah, did you just make a YouTube account? I'll give you a. a I'll be your second sub. Okay. All right. Um, so we go back into our file system manager. We run the same script one more time. The compare files. 
and hopefully it's 800 and it's supposed to be less than 800 fuck i wish we copied what the original number was uh let's see ugh, ugh, ugh. ah shit i mean i guess we could technically compare it but project settings oh actually wait let's see what what it says maybe it's still in our history here no, I think it got erased. Okay. Um, apparently, we kept the array in there, too. I don't know if that has any effect on anything. Uh, how do you go back to... There we go. Get that. Okay. Let's try that again. Hopefully that's the only issue. Uh, PNG test PNG. Um, do. Yeah, it's image, not PNG. <laughs> That's what happens when you come here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, moment of truth, don't crash. What the fuck? Daniel Pancake? You too? Alright, what's crashing now? Uh... Um, it still says... Can't load resource flesh hit impact sound thud punch where is this located uh okay i don't think we're loading resources correctly um in this preload node we're not going into this node and grabbing its its children um there has to be a better way to grab these files well we have to create a better uh preload manager uh, what I could technically do right now, if we really want to speed things up, is just grab this and throw it um, anywhere. Or, or literally just grab these files right here and throw it in. But here, let me just, yeah. Um, let me go into, uh, where, where is this located again? This, this node. Here, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to throw these preloads in here because I know it works this way. I'm curious, though. If we go into this node, we have preloads in here. And we have... How are they located in here? We we do some dictionary array stuff. I don't know if... Maybe, maybe something is... Maybe, maybe we check for dictionary arrays for whatever reason um, here. I'm, I'm just going to throw these files in here. I'm pretty sure we check for arrays. So if this doesn't work, uh, I don't know. I'm out of ideas. Uh, honestly, wait, let me see something. Firebox sounds. Wait, no, not firebox sounds. Where's our where do we throw this in? In here. Whatever the script is. Um, so this has preloads, but this is a dictionary. I don't know if we check for arrays too. Uh, but we have preload we have a firebox preload in here. Fuck. Here, I'm just gonna we're gonna we're gonna I don't wanna test too much, so I'm gonna just say bar one. All right, 
and let me just note to myself. Uh, what is this? Out of programming juice. What's going on here? Anybody have any experience exporting Godot projects to HTML5? Um, are you using C Sharp or GDScript? I think with GDScript, it's, I think it's nearly impossible with GDScript, if I'm not mistaken. Just GDScript. Um, anybody have any experience exporting Godot Project to HTML5? Oh, web. I'm not sure. I'm still in three. Okay, wait. This is only here because our uh, resource checker doesn't check inside children nodes yet. inside children resource inside children preload resources yet we have to come up i guess we we, we can do some recursive stuff but the, the thing is we're gonna have to like like if we have a preload here we'll have to create an instance of that preload then run things inside of that and like recursively go through it it's like you know my my brain can can only go like up to like three levels before before it breaks. Mm -hmm. All right, so um. I think that's it. We have to run chapter three again. It was 866, so we should see like a few less. Um, I have to run it here again. All right, so we just run get off. See. No, not get all file directories. Uh, run file check. No, fuck. Which one was it? Oh, run comparison. Here we go. Uh, so we should see less than 866. If we don't, then we fucked up somewhere. Yeah, there, there we go. 860. Mm -hmm. 
All right, moment of truth. Will it work? Did we we just export it, right? Okay. Please work, please work. Uh, refresh. Oh, look at that. It works. Hopefully, let's see. Chapter one. Oh, fuck. Wait, what's going on? Uh oh. Uh oh. No idea what happened. Um, I guess let's check the logs. Ah, perfect. These are, this is really good. It wasn't, yeah, no, it wasn't you. I was a robot, right? I think, uh, like if my CPU freaks out, my, um, my audio interface freaks out too. Um, so it seems like we crashed on the first instance of the game, uh, and we don't have any logs on it. Um, should I try it again? Let me see. No issues here. All right, yeah, I'm going to try it again. Um, it might crash. It probably will crash. Here, actually, wait, let's see chapter two. All right, chapter two is good. Uh-oh. What the fuck? Huh. Here, wait. But this time, wait, so this time we'll see a log. Crotos, gra okay, grass. The, oh, fuck, our grass is also broken. Okay, I think this is the only thing that's left, though. Um, this is why we need a preload manager. Like, either a preload manager or we have to, like, recursively go through literally every scene in our game. I think, honestly, recursively going through everything is probably the better approach. Uh, or not, I don't know if it's a better, it's better because then we wouldn't have to create a preload manager. Okay, so anything related to audio breaks the game. And it's the same thing, it's the same thing that broke chapter one too. Anything with these, these nodes right here. Um, so what do we want to do? Technically, I can, we can fix this immediately. Uh, we can either preload these files in the... Wait, 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 no. Wait. Um, this isn't the issue, actually. But you know what? Let me, let me look it up. Let's, let's look at these files here. Let me run... Uh, let's look at our resource checker again. Or, sorry, our file system manager. Uh, let's print everything. And let me just check if anything here looks, um, if anything here looks weird. Uh, it's probably the grass, if I had to guess. But wait, let me see. Uh, horse eating grass. Um, Rodos. Impact stereo. Um, Tomer, go. Maybe go to sleep. So maybe we you could play tomorrow too. Um, I'm trying, you know what it is? It's our resource manager. We have to, we, wait, 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 wait. I wonder, wait, 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 the, the, 
Grass. Oh, you know what else is broken? We don't preload. I don't think we preload any of the icons either. Let me see. I'm pretty sure we don't preload all of our icons. Here, you know what? Let's try this. Uh, I'm pretty sure the game will work if we remove everything. Let's see. If I export the game just like this. It's better if I play today. I don't know when I'm going to get this done. Hopefully in like an hour. Hopefully within the hour. Or, you know, you can also sleep for eight hours and I'll probably still be streaming. You're really trying. You doubt that? I streamed 14 hours yesterday. All right, so I'm pretty sure this will work, but this is not. Yeah, so I mean, this works, but this is not what we want. Um, let me see. So yeah, it, it's just one of these files are not correct. Or uh, probably a collection of these files are not correct. Uh, and I'm not entirely sure which one it is. Let me see. Uh, shoe? Oh, uh, the blue zone. Let me see something. We have a bunch of blue zone sounds. I wonder, I wonder how these are being instanced. Hmm. Ah, yeah, any of these blue zone blue zone sounds? This needs to be a preload. So this already broke. That's this is probably what broke chapter 1. Um environment sounds fuck. All right, I'm trying to think, dude. I'm trying to think. How do we I don't want to... Here, fuck it. I'll just preload it right now. See you at 3 a.m.? Alright. Dude, there's a fucking mosquito in my room. Oh my god. Get out of here, bro. Please. I just want to get this done. I was seriously asking. I don't know. I'm not sure. Environment sound node. When do we add this node? Mm, only in class name. Uh, so we must, I hope we preload this then. Let me see. Oh, we don't have a scene for this. We just... Hopefully we go through through the resources of this. Fuck. Oh my god. Yeah, this is going to be kind of annoying uh, when we actually have to do this. Honestly, we might do this soon though. Like maybe next next week. We'll create like a better system. Um, hopefully this fixes chapter one. Um, we might need to reload every single... But let me see stuff that's in chapter because chapter two also crashed on us and i, I want to say it's the grass but we we checked grass uh foot 
see foot third step foot third step foot 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 we can go through each of our files and we can look at our commits and see whenever we added uh WAV files too. Okay. Shoe. Feet mud. Krodos player SFX. Let me see. Mud shoes run zero one. It might be this one. Gravel movement. Maybe not, actually. Oh, shit. Actually, wait. We do use it. Footstep sounds. All right, so... In our footstep sounds node, we're not preloading any of this either. Um, all right. So wait, let me see. Do we have these nodes? All right, that's good though. We have these in our game. Let's see. Mm -mm -mm. Mm, this seems to be in our game too. Uh, so what the hell? Yeah, I'm not entirely sure what's crashing the game then. Let me see grass. Poor seeding grass. You know, uh, I wonder. We're not removing... Oh, we're only checking for audio files, not images. So, yeah, it's it has to be an audio file that's breaking the game. Unfortunately, there's so many... There's so many audio files here. I don't know... I don't know what else we can check for. Um, all right, so we, we did create a new preload for the environment sound. I guess maybe we can try it one more time and see if that fixed it. Run get, uh, run compare audio. Uh-oh, it's empty now. Uh-oh. Ah, uh, fuck. Did we erase data here? No, we have everything here. Uh, we have our array. Uh, run compare files. What the fuck? Um, run file check. Get all file directories, run file check. And then, oh, there we go. So I guess we'll do it one more time. Wow, wow. Holy shit, look at it. Oh my god. Uh we're still at three hundred we're still at eight hundred and sixty files. So I'm not entirely sure if we're gonna All right, wait. Let me go into project six word again. Let me export it with debug and see. Maybe that helps, if that helps.
All right, so it seems like chapter this first room works. Oh, wait. Okay, so with debug, it seems like it's fine. Um, but let me see. Uh, let's look at the logs. Yo, math room, how's it going? Hey, doing math room. Thanks for the raid. Okay. So, I mean, we're throwing a crap ton of uh, input node. Wait. Oh, because we're on. Okay, okay. Main scene, GDC, non-existent function, entity sounds. Non-existent function, pause, entity sounds. Script error. Uh, Wait. Sound playing. Oh, wait, no. Sound playing. That's fine. Sound playing, sound playing. Uh, Script error. Invalid index, uh, script error, non-existent play transition sound. Transition sounds, okay. Wait, but we don't have transition sounds. That's interesting. Or like, we don't remove transition sounds from the game. And this is also world zero invalid function play transition sound. What the fuck? Well, oh, I guess it's our script. Yeah, it's our script. Never mind. Non existent function. Mm -hmm. If you just remove memory from the game, perhaps. All right. Okay. The, the, the grass zones seem to be fine. Um, all right. So let's look, we'll look at this, the trans, uh, play trans here. Let me just copy all of this. Um, and then the second you get in the current animation playing is the fire animation. That's fine. And then another script error is the, um, main scene. Test nodes, main scene, non-existent function, paused entity sounds is not working either. Let's see. Boom. Okay. Why didn't we check for errors? Wait, let me see something. Uh, get node not found environment time. This is fine to have as an error, though. Uh, relative to root. So this is our chapter two sounds, I think. I guess we, yeah, we don't have a environment sounds timer anymore. Um, do we have it for chapter three though? Probably. Could that be what's uh, making us crash? Oops. I mean, I'll keep that there. Let's see what else, though. All right, we're getting some signal errors, too, but... See? Body shape. 
Alright, this is whatever. Okay. <sighs> what were the other errors, though? Let me see. Uh, wait, what? Oh, right here. No, wait, what? For the... Oh, right here. Um, play transition sound, non-existent function on world node dot play transition sound. Sounds dot current chapter sounds node dot play transition sound current chapter sounds node. Play transition sound. You know, chapter two. Fuck. So, how is that even possible? Non-existent function play transition sound on base nil. Oh, that means, okay, wait, it doesn't exist then. Um, I mean, I guess we can check if it's a valid instance first, but uh, current chapter sounds node sounds like current chapter sounds node. It's equal to equal to null. Equal to. Okay. Match the chapter. We say it's equal to the scene enter chapter. Uh, add child. Mm -mm 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 -mm. When are we queue for this? On exit chapter. What about? Oh, I guess it doesn't matter. Um, yeah, I feel like we would have fi figured this out already. Um, if this was an issue. All right, we fixed chapter. Oh, well, but we are still getting errors with the chapter sound. Um, it, originally it was the with the eyeball sound node though. Mm -mm, mm -mm, eyeball sounds preload manager. Wait. Eyeball. Okay, yeah, it's always the preload manager. We, we fixed that already, I think. We also have this can't... Oh, wait. This. Flesh hit impact thud. Yeah. We don't have this. But didn't, didn't we fix this? Yeah, we fixed this, I think. Is it still an issue? Fuck. Um, I guess there's only one way to find out. Um, actually, we can find out right now. Before we even load anything. Uh, let's grab this again.
we should send this to a file so I don't have to copy and paste this all the time. Okay, let me throw this in here. Uh, where was it? Uh, yeah, we removed it. Okay, that's good. Oh, dude, my eye is itchy. What the hell? Ugh. <sighs> All right, so we fixed that issue. Let me erase it. So that was just with the eyeball sound, and then this is the same exact thing, right? Sounds.gd non existent resource. Class was found in the global scope, but its script couldn't be loaded. Uh, sounds like you make sure resources have been imported. Only thing left for us to do, I guess, is to finally got my computer uh, set up at my desk. Nice. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's close this. Uh, why, why is this actually being... Wait, let me see something. Our resource, this thing is being, re needs to be reloaded, see? Scene, resource, database. I think it's fine, all right. Um, I think we already exported it, and I think it's probably gonna crash again, but uh, let's see if we get anything in the logs. Okay, everything seems fine here. And then the second we load in to, let's go into chapter two. It's in the post? All right. Oh, dude, wait, what the hell? All of our grass is gone. Wait, what the hell? Is this the wrong scene? Oh, it is. <laughs> Whoops. Wrong, wrong executable. All right, so we can see grass here. It's very pretty. And then the second we go into the room, this room, we crash. Uh, look at our log here. Charge up, charge up. Uh, sound playing. Yeah, and then we crash the second we go in. Um, all right, so uh, let's export again, but with debug. What are we, what the hell are we removing? What are we uh, debugging? So um, on export, I'm removing like files that we don't use in the game. Um, but the thing is, uh, and the way I go about it is by removing files. Like I run the game and I check which files are currently in the game. Um, and then I compare that list to all of the files that are in our, fi in our project directory. And if, yeah, if that file isn't in our game, then I append that file, and that's what we're doing here. Uh, filters to exclude uh, from the project. Uh, scenes or, or file paths to exclude from the project. Um, oh, sh yeah. So, for instance, uh, room 2 is never used in the project, so I remove room 2. If uh, room 16, or like we collect all the rooms, but we also collect a bunch of sound files. 
And that's probably what's happening here. Uh, there's a sound file that we threw into the game that we're no longer we're no longer using. Um, but the the other issue is that um, sometimes we're throwing object like right now. This could be done with a secondary Git repository. How so? Or a separate branch. So yeah, like like if, if I actually created a separate like a separate branch and actually checked which files I was using all the time and being like I guess careful about it. Just throw each new file maybe with the script uh to detect unused files. And add them to the git ignore. So I think it, like in essence, that's what I'm doing without Git though. I just did it within the project. Uh, I think the approach to it is still going to be the same. Um, I'm trying to think like, I guess th there's one other thing I could do technically. Yo, how's it going, Irad? There's one other thing I like. I could rewrite every like if I rewrote everything and recursively went through our entire game, or recursively went through uh, like all of our scenes, then this wouldn't be an issue. Um, but yeah, at some point, if we do like, yeah, at some point, and 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 the thing is, I don't mind having like. Yeah, like I don't mind having a bunch of files in my, uh, in my system, in my in my project. It's it's more so just when we're exporting that that it becomes an issue. Um, all right. So here, uh, let me try this again. The thing is, that's weird. Okay, yeah, I guess we'll find out right now. We run through this room. It doesn't crash like if we oh um maybe it does crash because our screen is what the hell did i do this that's weird let me say that again it didn't crash but the game like paused all right wait we might not see, might need to restart, but I'm going to our logs again. Okay. Cannot save file, singleton, scene resource database. Wait, we don't want to save this. Maybe that's what's crashing us, but this is when be good to see when this is happening input node oh because we're okay okay uh this is happening because we're still uh in debug but technically this should never run okay no loader found protos uh mournful ship oh yeah um the thing is um let me see We didn't crash here either way, so it's interesting that this happened. But here, can we can we uh, can we wrap this? Uh, yo, how's it going back up? Here, wait, check this out.
So these are preloaded, these general sounds. Let me see. I guess we'll find it. That's so weird. <gasps> mm, maybe this is a... Wait, do we have this as a, like a child or something? What's this general sounds preload node? Let's see? Last name. Uh, general sounds node. In chapter two. General sounds preload node. All right, general sounds node. Is our horn here? And it's it is this sound. Uh long blast. I thought we we're going through through streams, but maybe not in in these files? I don't know. I thought we would have, but here, let's go back into um, that horn sound. Let me see something. Let's check. Is it not? Is it in here? It is. Okay. Um. So this also needs, wait, long blast one. Long blast one. Let me see. Can't see shit. Long blast three. Long blast. Ah, yeah. Okay, all of these sounds need to be added. And it seems like they're not. Um, oh, this is kind of annoying. I'm trying to think. Do we want to, like, spend the next, like, five hours creating something to, like, recursively go through all of our nodes? Or do we just, like, fix every error that we find along the way? Here, let me see. Um, um, so wait, where is this? So yeah, none of these, all right, let's see. None of these files are being loaded in. Uh, wait, this one's fine. Um, so it seems like it's only mournful blast. Is this the same exact word? Oh no, short. Just make sure I'm grabbing the right file. Actually, this might be fine also. So these are fine. What the frick? What's this copy path of this? Let's see. Okay, yeah, this one though, for whatever reason, is not being. What the hell? Oh, it got cut off, that's why. Long Blast 5 though, but Long Blast 5 is still not, it's also removed. Yeah. Um, so if we were to remove, like, technically, if we remove this right now, let me save. Maybe that, that only solves one issue, though. 
Uh, let's keep going through these errors. See what else there is. Uh, mournful ship. Here, let's. Oops. Non-existent resource at. Anything related to this? Let's get rid of. Chapter three sounds okay. So everything here is gonna break. Cannot save file singletons. Uh. Alright, that's fine. Enemy manager. Okay, here we go. The icon SVG icon SVG should have worked, yeah. See? Yeah. Oh, there is another sound that doesn't exist. It's the running shoes. Whatever this is. Oh wait, no, sound playing. See, World GD play transition sound. Oh, I think that's the same thing. The transition sound that was breaking. And then also invalid index win sounds node is also breaking. What the, I thought we fixed this. I thought we had this working. A long time ago. All right. Uh, sound play. Oh yeah, this is not an error. Um, play transition sound on base. It seems like, oh, fuck, like our sounds node, I guess because it, it, I guess it broke because we didn't have the, the correct transition sound node. And when you enter a new room, that's what... Oh, yeah, I think that's what happened. Okay. Um, so, we have this horn sound. Let me see something. Horn dot play. Or you know what? Let's just grab whatever this was for a second. <laughs> um, general sounds. Here, let me just grab one of these. Short blast. I'll throw this in here. Wait, what the hell? What the frick? Is this still here? What is this? What? Oh, what the hell this is? Let's get refresh it. Okay. That's what breaks chapter two, um, I think. Let's see what breaks chapter one. Um, let me just delete all of this. Yeah, let me start over. I think chapter one breaks immediately. Resource database is fine. Credit import node. Division by zero. Apparently, apparently you're not allowed to divide by zero. Since when? All right. Um, let's, let's see. Uh, I wonder, I wonder why this would break, though. Like, it's not breaking. Is it breaking in our game? In, let me see. I feel like this wouldn't, let's see. I guess maybe. Here, let's try it. Mm. 
We're getting an error here. But this is on something else. The environment sounds node. Is it, would this break in game? It, I feel like this wouldn't break the game. Let's see. All right. Um, let's see what else we got here. Uh, we still get this um, division by zero operator on credit nodes uh, because we're not importing. I don't think we're imp we're not. Are we importing JSON files? I don't think we are. That's probably why it's not working. Oh, no, no, we are. We are. What the fuck? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Um, config files and on export. Oh, maybe. Uh, actually, there aren't any JSON files, I guess. All right, so hopefully that fixes that issue. Um, let me just double check, actually. Mm -mm. What's it for? Credit import node. 174. Uh, tombstone usernames. <clears throat> uh, random index is equal to random tombstone. Uh, get all tombstones names. If it's equal to zero, we say get all. Uh... But yeah, if it's equal to zero. Yeah, this file is being loaded in. Um, I mean, I guess we could check if it's zero again. If it's zero again, then something is wrong with importing this file. But get all... Blah, 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 blah. Uh, get all tombstone names. And input credit. It's all credit data. All credit data. Load all credit file data. And this is opening the JSON file and the file path is right. Credits path. It's equal to rest JSON. Okay. Yeah, um, JSON, I don't think we, I thought JSON files by default were loaded, but maybe not, I guess. Right, because we never, we actually don't have any JSON files in our, in our game, in our project folder. Uh, so that's probably why. All right, um, let's see what else we got here. Hopefully that's it. Uh, environment sounds... Uh, environment timer relative to root sounds chapter one. Uh, I feel like this the division by zero is probably what broke us. Um, 
Singletons. Scene resource database. Can't open. That's fine. Can't tell where the hell we are. All right, yeah, I think that was it. Hopefully, that is it. So, I actually had nothing to do with our project files. Uh, yeah, I'll, uh, we'll just do it as a debug. Chapter 3 might still be broken, though. Um, you know what? We should have exported as a as a debug first. And checked. All right, yeah, I'll probably do that. We'll, we'll just make another file here called debug. All right, so yeah, we'll try the debug first. Uh oh. Uh, what happened? Oh, is it because we're sharing? Uh, what? What the hell? Okay, mm -hmm. moment of truth. Chapter one. Okay, I think I think we're good. All right. Now let's go for chapter 2. Timer wasn't added to the scene tree either. Ba -ba -ba -ba. What is this for? Uh, timer was not added to the scene tree either. Added or set an auto start to true. Calling Silent Wolf to post player data. All right, Silent Wolf. Ah, it feel. It seems like we have. Oh, uh, what's this? Calling animation finished. I think this is signal stuff that we broke. Uh, but that, I think that's it. Okay, and finally, we'll fix the signals later. Uh, chapter three. Okay. Timer for Silent Wolf. Uh, flushing Physics 2D. Activating pressure plate spring. Can't change this state while flushing queries. Use call defer. Okay. On. Okay. So we have the same. Oh, this is. Here, wait. Let's let's clean everything. Let's clear everything. Yes. Okay. Uh, what the hell? Mm, what the hell?
How dare you? How many do we owe? Fucking 80. Oh, all right. I think we're good. Um, maybe I'll run it a few. I'll play it a little bit. If something's going to break, oh, if something is going to break, it'll be here. Perhaps. Just double, triple check. I think we're good. So if we run this in the demo now. Ah. Let's see. Oh, nice. All right, I think we're good. All right. Uh, wait, let me finish checking through all the other rooms. Bum, bum, bum. Dude, oh my god, finally. Alright. How long did that take? Four hours? 420? We're about to hit 420. Happy 420, everybody. Okay. Uh, there are a few more things we can do. Uh, I need to make sure that we're constantly... Uh, one thing I should do in... Our script here. I should do actually. I should do some push-ups first. Uh...
How are the arms? I don't know why. Yesterday? Yesterday I felt like I could do so many. Right, maybe I'm sore. Because, I don't know. They're a lot harder to do today for some reason. Should switch the exercise up, yeah. Uh, I have been working out in my room though. Like I've been doing, um, I've been doing squats. I've been doing like shoulder raises in my room too. Uh, by, by doing, I mean, I did it today prior to any other day. I didn't really do any of them, but yeah, I, I am going to start. I was gonna. I'm trying to figure out how to switch up the redeems. Okay. Um. Um. Inner file system manager. I'm just gonna create another variable right here. Doesn't need to be an export. We'll say var. Files, static, files. Could be just the uh, different things, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Oh yeah, that's not a bad idea too. All right, um, so we need to remove the notes folder. Notes folder is my, actually, memory notes. Oh, no, no, yeah, we'll do memory notes. Wait, wait, what the fuck? I have something called notes, memory notes, and then inside memory notes, it's called memory, and then inside memory, it's called notes. We, we go full circle. Notes, memory notes, memory. And then notes. It's because uh, this wasn't originally uh, supposed to be here. Mm, oh, uh, let me update our push ups. One, two, three, four. Okay. Let's remove the entire directory. Mm -hmm. Right. So we want to remove notes. Uh, anything else I want to remove? Um, any chapters? We don't really need any chapters. Chapter four. Mm -hmm. Copy path. Chapter four. Chapter five. Chapter six. Technically, it doesn't really matter to remove these rooms because we already re removed the 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 rooms inside of them. So it actually doesn't really matter at all. But it's whatever. Um. Anything else we need? Let's see Twilight. All right, actually, let me commit this.
I'm curious, do we ever grab this in our player? Doesn't seem like it. I think we're good uh so oh actually wait before we do that when we i should i should export this to like a text file or something um we'll do that later where's the static paths all right when we when we run uh compare when we print this um There we go. All right. I think we are done. Uh, notes. Here, let me go through. What the hell? Uh, notes is good. Let me go through our file system here. Let's see if there's anything else we want to remove. Easter eggs. Executables. Uh, I'm pretty sure... Executables already gets ignored. I guess we could remove it to let's see executables executables let's throw that in there too mm -mm. i'll throw it up here actually do, 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 do. fonts legal what's legal oh that's my legal stuff uh, level editor, logs. What's logs? Godot log. When was this? Uh, eleven twenty. It's a long time ago. Menu, new art, notes, other. Do 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 HUD. Stream help. Oh, let's remove that. Although I wonder, I wonder if we no, we definitely do not use this. Stream help. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, we have something called test nodes. Uh, but I'm fairly confident we actually use a few... We actually use a few of these in our test nodes and like I tested it out in this in this folder and then we found that it works and then I just didn't didn't remove anything. We should probably clean up this folder at some point. And we also have something called test with a bunch of T's afterwards. And it comes with an executable. <laughs> I don't know why the hell this isn't here. Uh, rounding test, physics platform, binds tile set test, tween test, test tool script, test movement. It seems like a lot of these are actually tests, though. Um, and apparently we have something, we have a Jacob's Afterlife in here. Can you see this? Check this out. An old version of, of the game that doesn't work. Why doesn't it work? Dang. Should we, we could remove executables and PCK files. See? All right, uh, we can do that in here though. And what did I want to remove? Uh, PCK. All right. Uh, we're not done. We need one more file to remove. Uh, so we have to run this again. Uh, run compare. Wait, why is it still saying 160? Let me see. Um, oh, wait, what? Uh, I think it's because we, we didn't save. Let's run it again. Hundred and sixty eight, there we go. All right. Cool. Let me throw this into a notepad. All right. Fly TSN. Uh yeah, everything is good. Okay, so this is let's say point one. Memory demo 0.9.5.1. Uh, let's go into our. Uh, why is the Microsoft Store open? Let me delete all every every other executable that we have here. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Where is uh, uh, the PCK file? I wonder. Hey, what the hell? What happened to our PCK file? Let's try that again. Oh, because it's not done. Holy shit, why is it taking so long? Storing file. Wait, what? Oh, holy shit. You know what's weird? Oh shit, yeah, we, whoops. I almost, that's why we're taking so long. 
We were throwing we were throwing like like 50 gigs worth of files in there into our project. Uh, okay. All right. Um let me save this. Let me run this one more time. So now we should be at uh, a little over, I think we should be at 870 or something like that. Yeah. Okay. And yeah. Oh shit, what the hell? Why'd it go here, dude? Cannot remove. Alright, fuck it. Uh, we want it to be in executables. Hmm. Memory demo. Editor, uh, custom editor export. I sure haven't. Custom editor export. What, what does that include? I've done a, a decent amount of like. Tool scripts. I don't know what what exactly an editor export plugin is though. Let's make sure this worked. Memory demo. I see. Um, I didn't know there was this class. Um, I, I guess I sort of, wait, let me see. Export file. So yeah, um, it might've been nice to know that this existed. Um, but yeah, I do it. I sort of do it manually, not manually, but um, I mean, either way, like, I mean, I think we could still technically use it, but, um, yeah. Basically what I do is I just run this, uh, I run this file manager's, uh, tool script. And then when I export, I just mess with these two parameters here. Um, but yeah, it probably will be much nicer when we have to export to different types of, uh, different platforms and stuff. Or even, even, uh, languages. I haven't, I haven't got to that, gotten to that point yet. Uh, but fortunately my, I don't think it'll be too much work. All right. Moment of truth. Uh, all right. Memory demo start. I will select here. Let's make a new actually right now. First, let me see. All right. Oh, uh, we'll probably want to move our player around first. There are no grass nodes here, but I think we 
removed grass nodes. Also, there are no... Can we see? Uh, I'm not entirely sure why, but we shouldn't be hearing the mud sound here. Uh, but we might have uh, we might have replaced it recently, actually. So, all right, and this looks good so far. Um, before I forget, uh, let me just include a few more things that we need to do. Um. Reset player positions. Delete. Print statements. Don't worry, keep up the great work. Thanks. Yeah, um, I'm sure, like, even with the export plugin, I'm sure you'll still, I, I'm not sure. I guess it depends on, uh, like, in hindsight, um, if I knew I was going to remove, like, audio files, um, maybe I would have had a better approach to, like, storing everything. Um, but, yeah. I'm sure the export uh, plugin is probably good, though. Like, maybe I'll use it. Uh, maybe I'll look into it when I get closer to release. All right. Um, okay. Um, oh wait. Let's let's run it on chapter. Let's look at chapter two again. Although I'm pretty sure it all works. Uh, we could look at the leaderboard too, just to double check. Ideally, we should probably beat all the levels too. Uh, and we can probably should turn on audio just to make sure everything works here. Oh, uh, there is a bug right there with the flame. Um, we probably should fix that too. Uh, here, let's do that real quick. Let's write it down. Flame on chapter two, broken. Okay. Um, why do you, do you mind explaining why it's a 680, um, there are a lot of files and it's also encrypted, so that's probably why it's that large. Uh, how much is it? Oh shit, yeah, it's pretty large. What the hell? Mm, let me see. Yeah, 1.8 gigs. Um trying to think. We did throw a lot of files in, but I, I'm not I'm not sure why it's actually that large. Let me see. There might be like a really By exporting as a zip. Let me see. Let 
Yeah, we still have a bunch of stray files. Like, for instance, I don't know how, how much it'll actually take. Here, let me see. Like, for instance, the grass. Here, like, if we look at our... Verify by exporting as the zip. Right, okay. Um, but here... Let me just see. We do have a lot of audio files, but... Oh, yeah, wait. Uh, let me see the sound files. Uh, where the hell is it? Yeah, 1.54 gigs of sounds. But we removed everything. Wonder what there must be just other sounds. Uh or I mean maybe that's how many sounds. I mean maybe that's how many sounds we have uh imported into our game. It's all the feet picks I forgot. Yeah. Converting all my audio from lossless uh, to lossy. Um, why? Because of the file size? <clears throat> How much audio do you have in your game? Yeah, it's definitely just the audio, but I'm surprised even I guess we can we can check how many audio files are in our game um, and then is there a way to calculate file size? In Godot. Bits or something. Maybe. I don't know. Because we, we know how many audio, like all the file, audio files that are in our game. We can check, but yeah. And I'm sure, like, even though I have a bunch of audio files, like, that are preloaded. Uh, I'm sure there are a bunch of them that I'm also not using. It's just that if I didn't, let me see, like dot wav. Oh, it's not even that many. Well, these are the only sounds that are preloaded, but still, it's not that many. Yeah. Hmm. I wonder, I wonder what's taking, I wonder what we're playing here. You know, there might be, there was this one audio file that I put into the game. I think it was a, um, like Blue Zone, for instance, is, is probably pretty hefty. Let me see. Oh, but we have it all commented out. Let's see. Like, how big is this file? Sixteen megabytes around. It's not that much. Uh, I'm so very happy someone with a way more done game than me is considering uh, the same questions I do while I just run in circles. Yeah. Um, to be fair, I mean, yeah, it, it's really just the audio and like. I don't know. I, I feel like. I mean, if you have I, I, I like having really good audio in my game, though, so I'm not sure. 
I'd, I'd sacrifice file size for, for good audio, personally. Mm -mm. Okay. Um, All right, let's fix... I think we... Oh, yeah, let's reset player positions. Also, before we do anything, I want to make sure we didn't crash anywhere. Uh, like, I'm waiting on Tomer anyway, and Tomer's sleeping, so... We can do some some quick tests and fix some of these bugs too actually uh less than four gigs is probably okay for steam yeah um i think right now i'm just directly uploading to steam so like i think if you have two gigs as long as you're less than two gigs uh good for me right now yeah we'll have to do some spring cleaning at some point um but yeah i, I want a better approach to uh rewriting uh where the hell is that i'm not rewriting uh i want a better approach yeah yeah a better approach to grabbing all of our preloads um not sure when I'm gonna probably closer to release we'll probably work on that tool. Um yeah. mm -hmm. oh uh so I wanna run this in debug. Wait, actually, wait, here, let's go, let's leave. Um And also, we should check for secrets, too. We should run through some secret rooms. Um, I can do that in Chapter 1. So here, let's export again. Um, all right. Uh, wait, what the hell? Why is it? Why is this here? Let's get rid of it. Uh, blah, 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 blah. where is it? Executables, boom. And yeah, let's get rid of this. Um, let's try chapter two real quick first. Let's just make sure this works. Uh, options. Here, let me turn off the music. Yo, Robotech, how's it going? All right, it seems like Chapter 2 is good. Uh, we do have one extra node, actually, in Chapter 2. You know what? Fuck it. Let's quickly speed run through um, just to the pressure plates. Although, I'm pretty sure, actually, Tomer already played through this. Unless we, uh, we might have made some updates to it at some point. Oh, actually, here, let's check out this gate real quick. Uh, let me see. Uh, wait, was that chapter three? Oh, chapter, that's chapter five, I believe. Uh, pretty good. How's life treating you? Did you figure out your your whole asset situa situation? I remember, yeah, you were saying, you were mentioning your assets. And yeah, I'll tell you, like, I know, well, when you said you're, you're working on the game for yourself, 
Uh, and I would say, like, don't sweat the assets too much. Um, yeah, like my game, for instance, I've switched up the assets so often. Uh, especially during the earlier stages. Um, and not even, like, especially during the earlier stages and in, like, the mid stages. And, I mean, even now I'm, like, considering changing some stuff around. So it's, like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't worry about, like, what the current state of your game looks like. I mean, it's okay to worry about it, but just know, like, I think it's a, it's an, like, a, almost like a natural thing. You can make some updates to it now, and you might like it now, after you make those updates, but then, you know, two months later, you might be like, hey, I want to change the assets again, or I want to make an upgrade to the, to the graphics again. Uh, but I know, I know where you're going through. Cause I remember like stressing over, like, I remember stressing over what my game was supposed to look like for a very long time. I kept like, I kept going back and forth between really minimalistic and like really detailed and yeah, it was a, it was a lot, it was a lot to figure out that perfect balance. Decided to go ahead and switch. Nice. What do you what do you what are you thinking for switching? Oh my god, I can't beat this room. Alright, this right here. Yeah, it seems like the there are no bugs for this little part right here. Fuck. All right, I think we're good. The game is ready. Uh, let's see. Mm -mm -mm. This looks pretty cool. I like it. I dig the style. Ba, 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 da, ba, ba. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Very cool, very cool. Gandalf hardcore. Well, they got some sussy stuff on here though. Sussy wussy. Okay. You bought their complete collection. Nice. Hell yeah. I'm looking forward to the new art art redo. Okay. Um uh I think we are DJ all the way. Um I think we're ready for exporting. I'm trying to oh wait, 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 let's fix these. There are a couple of bugs here. Let's do uh reset play. Okay, that's what we're gonna do right now. Uh Where the hell? Where the hell is it? Um.
Is this the first demo release? Um, no. There have been so many. There, yeah, there have been a bunch of releases in the past. Just so I'm not baiting anyone, uh, just so you know, it's it's a private demo for backers right now. I do plan on giving a, making a public one at some point, but this is specifically for a, a specific backer tier. I should I should add an FAQ for that actually. I should actually make it. That's actually a really good idea. You know, for now, let's say private play test. <laughs> chapter one, actually, chapter one is a little jank. Um, our rooms here, I mean, we only have like one, two, three, four, five, uh, tombstones. Here, wait, let me, I'll throw in more. Tombstone. Do, 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 do. Okay. What's today? Is today Friday? Yeah. Right. Do, 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 do. All right, uh, close all of this. All right, what's next? Um, flame on chapter two is broken, all right? And delete if statements. Okay, so we reset player positions. Um, <clears throat> Uh, 
Um, so there's an error here with the... Uh, do we have fire particles anywhere saved? No. Can we say get node or null? Or, you know, we could just set it to true right now. We could just do that. Call it a day. I guess what we could do is if editor hint, but you know what? Fuck it. Let's just do that. Uh, or we could add a, a script here. Set it to emitting right away. Um, but this works. Fuck okay, it. We'll just leave it like this. All right, there we go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, uh, All right, I think that is everything. I guess we play the game a couple of times, or we'll do a, we'll we'll do a we'll do a run right now. See how the game how the game plays. Oh, uh, technically, there's one other thing we want to do when we release the game, and that's to change the version number in the in the global script. Uh, but I'll do that later. Mm -hmm. All right. So all the backers right here, um, they're randomly generated or not randomly generated, uh, randomly placed the names right now. So if there are more people, if you like, every time you respawn, it'll be a different name. Uh, but it's guaranteed. I'm pretty sure if you like refresh right now and We've already used a name. Like, for instance, I think we... Let me see. So, like, right now we don't see solar. Oh, wait, we do see solar. But yeah. It should be good, though. Yeah, let me turn off my mech. Oh, I think we're currently playing Flowerhead's song. I wonder if we should remove that. We definitely need more ambient sounds, though. Oh, this is an old one, too, actually. What the hell? Oh my god, that song scared me. Mm -hmm. uh, we should definitely do some secrets. I'm pretty sure this account... Oh, fuck. I actually don't know if we have all the secrets on this account. Let me see. We'll find out right now. Oh, we have that one. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, there's no, there's actually no point of this secret. 
Mm. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Oh, what the hell? Uh, yeah, it's a setting. It's not on by default either. All right, let me. We didn't go through any of the secrets. Oh my god. Or barely any of the secrets. I meant to do that. The secret chapters. I love the sound. Oh no. Alright, there's a secret over here. Oh, but we can't unlock it because we didn't ever we didn't unlock it on chapter 
on our account. All right, so uh, we know that works then, I guess. Uh, let's finish with our... Uh, I, f I forgot which one. I think it's this account, yeah. We'll do chapter three now. I'm pretty sure everything else works. Uh, I don't know where the other secrets are, but... Let's see. Will it be locked to uh, 60 FPS? Um, I, I have it locked on 60 FPS. Um, yeah. I'm not even sure what would happen if it wasn't locked to 60 FPS. Kind of sad not being able to. Um, don't feel too bad. Um, I, I don't know if I would have been able to play your game either way. Um, like, because I'm going in order of people that I see in the uh, the Google form. Um, but, I mean, if those people aren't there, then I can play your game. Oh, well, yeah, then, then you can be sad. Oh, not your... Oh, my bad. You're talking about the uh, the reviewer people? The... Ah, shit. Dude, that sucks. Dude, I... How's it going, Kai? Um, what the fuck? That, dude, why not? I was all like, yeah, Kai. I mean, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Daniel, like, I'm too busy, you know? Don't don't sweat it, you know? Uh, you think you think I'm just going to play your game? You think not enough people, you know, want me to play test their game? But then that, that, that does suck. Sorry to hear that. I mean, is is there a chance that you can? Uh, at the end, I decided literally to stitch previous gameplay build with the updated menu, changing executables midair. Oh, a new update to the showcase. That means you're still, it's still going to be showcased, just not the new stuff. Okay, for, for, uh, I read that as like, oh, you're like, you're not even going to be able to showcase your game. Dynamic refresh rate support is a big plus. Um, I can try it out. I mean, the physics process is still going to be the same. Um, and like, for instance, animations are locked at 60 FPS either way. Or animations, like, for instance, are 12 FPS. The only thing that you would see in difference is like camera movement, I guess. Um... I can try unlocking it. You can see what it looks like. Oh, wait, what the hell? Did I see that correct? Oh, my God. Oh, no, never mind. It looks so weird. I've never seen that before. Camera, yeah, the camera movement and the uh, the movement, I guess. Um, I'd have to see if it would impact gameplay in any way. Um, I don't think it would, but 
I never did did much research on that. What do color lines? It's for debugging. It just shows what state the player was in. So like, for instance, blue is oh you can't see, blue uh, is is jump, green is fall, red is dash. This little light blue that you see here is like the uh, neutral state. Uh, it's sort of like a transition state that I have. It's technically the fall state, but uh, certain neutral, de de depending on like what your previous state was or certain things can, can influence that, that neutral state. Fallout 4? I think it, um... Yeah, I know Fallout... Was it Fallout 4? That was locked? Or Fallout New, uh, New Vegas? Fallout 4, I feel like they had a higher frame rate at this point, right? Oh shit, wow, that's crazy. I'm curious. Does Celeste have a uh, dynamic? Um, can you can you does it does it allow for higher frame rates? Can check Celeste. Yeah, I'm mostly concerned with uh, speed running. That's the only issue. If it has any impact whatsoever, I can't allow it. I mean, maybe I could allow it, but you know, uh, runs would have to be invalid or something. You know. If it doesn't have any impact on on anything related to speedrunning. I know you're saying, oh, multiply by delta, but yeah, I don't know. Maybe there's some other things in there. Also, uh, yeah, we're prepping for release, um, Kai, so that's all we've been doing today. We had a really long stream yesterday. I'm still kind of exhausted, but we're getting we're getting shit done. Uh, it's basically done, actually. I don't think we're. I'm just playtesting chapter three. Uh, I'm pretty pretty sure it's all done. I'm just. We've got nothing better to do anyway. After this, we'll probably work on the overlay. Um, we'll see. Hmm. Mm. Kind of chance for a, I, I don't know what it is, but it's it's kind of weird that you're into my burps. Not gonna lie. Um, yeah, I mean, sure, you can find it funny, but I don't know, dude. It's weird when it's the only thing you ask for. Um, so, yeah, dude, I'd, yeah, I'd appreciate it if you stopped. Like, I don't know. If you enjoy it, I'm sure you can keep it to yourself. Thank you. I don't want to keep asking you, so please, please don't do it.
1.4 is fixed at, at 60. Uh, there is no way to change that. I also know that the music from Hollow Knight, uh, that music from, oh yeah, it is from Hollow Knight. Is fixed or isn't fixed at 60? I, I think you said uh, probably is fixed since your next statement was no way to change that. Is fixed, okay. I mean, they made their they made their game in in uh, what is it, mono game? So I mean, yeah, maybe there was a reason why they they locked it. Um, Celeste is a lower resolution. No, it's the same exact resolution. What's up? How's it going, NTJ Cup? Um, your game looks higher. So there is one thing uh, that my game does. My game has a lot more detail than than Celeste. That doesn't make it, that doesn't make it better. Um, but yeah, when when you're when you have a less skilled artist working on a game. Um, it's easier to hide that that like that that skill with like more detail. So, for instance, uh, Celeste, you know, uses like I also use eight by eight tiles in my game, but I use sixteen by sixteen textures for a lot of things. Uh, it doesn't you don't see it in this game. You don't see it on this. Uh, you don't see it in in this tile map. But yeah, was that great thingy? Ist, ja, itch. Oh, ist is, 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 ist is, also is, right? In German. What was that gray thingy? What gray thingy? Like a pickup item. Did I pick something up? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you're talking about the sushi. Uh, the collectible. See on... Do I have it right here? Collectibles, 8 out of eight out of 11. Uh, it's not going to be a sushi anymore. Um, it's probably going to be, like, physical items. Like, uh... Like, uh... I don't know, like a shoe or, or like, some, some other stuff. I'm not sure yet. Uh, originally it was going to be a collection of items and then I got lazy, uh, or like creating a variety of items was a lot of work. Uh, so I removed it, but yeah, we're going to go back. I'm sure we can get a fair share, but thank you zoomer, by the way, <laughs> thank you for the kind words. Is this heaven? Uh, actually, I mean, this is more like limbo. I mean, this chapter specifically looks more like hell. Oh my god, I can't see shit with all these lines on the screen. I haven't played this kind of game in years. Oh my god. I don't know. I don't remember how to play my own game. I'm gonna take these lines off. Hmm. 
Oh my god, please relax. There we go. Sections are looking gnarly. Yeah, this one is especially we're getting we're getting close like so this is chapter three so like oh fuck yeah i finally get a chance to make harder rooms it's 4 30 and it's bright as day all right daniel pancake have a good one peace But yeah, um, the, just for the memes, adios, uh, what was I going to say? Fuck, I, re I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, yeah, 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 uh, for the level design. We, we've made most of the simple levels, uh, even for the later chapters, and now any any future levels that I make now are a lot more, like, puzzle-based. Uh, since we've, we've basically made all of the intros. Um, all of the intros to the mechanics, that is. all aboard the pain train now yeah basically even, but even then i like i haven't made too many difficult rooms i think what i'll probably end up doing is um i'm not even sure like even my secret rooms are not that challenging oh shit i think we messed up here because now i think we yeah there's a bug currently in the game um I'll I'll post it. I'll post this version of the game right now. Um for Tomer to to download whenever he whenever he wakes up, but um yeah, we should probably fix that before we release the release the demo. Oh my god. Oh my god. What's good is that hard stuff is really fun to watch. Yeah. Um, yeah. Like, yeah, you have to be careful. I, I mean, if you have a really good looking game, though, that's, that's, it's okay to have a, like, honestly, my game should be harder for sure. Um, and I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep designing the game the way it is. I mean, it's still challenging. Like, I'm I'm maybe making it look e relatively easy because, you know, I have so many hours in the game. And I've, you know, designed everything. Um, but it, it will be very hard. Or hard for, you know, a new user, for sure. Like, even Tomer probably struggles with some rooms. Whoops. Did Celeste show their hardest stuff while marketing? Um, I don't think so. Or at least not like in any of their trailers. Um, Celeste, actually Celeste when it first started wasn't like when they first released the game, um, wasn't that challenging. It wasn't, it was only after like several updates, you know. The thing that's nice about this game is, though, uh, is that we'll have level editors. 
Um, so if I can't make hard rooms, at least, you know, someone else can. It's all, it's going to be like, there's a strong community base for this game. Or at least that's what I'm trying to do. Oh my god. Uh is it already made? Nope. Not at all. I haven't even I haven't even like written a single line of I, that's not true. I, I have written a few lines of code. Uh but a long time ago. Um but it's basically it's basically uh written, uh, like pointless now. I'll have to I'll probably I I, I will definitely rewrite it at this point. This is the boss fight. Here, I'll show you guys. Or, yeah, I'll show you guys. Got Yeah, honestly, I, I'm glad I didn't work on it because a lot of things have changed since then. The, the, the weird thing is that we do, we have a combination of, like, a combination of nodes and tile maps. And, like, positions of them are also kind of weird. Um, so, yeah. I'm glad I didn't work on it because, yeah, it, it would, probably wouldn't have worked out. Uh, and when I did work on the level editor, it was a lot, like, it was a lot, uh, lots, uh, what am I trying to say here? I wasn't as, like, familiar with Godot, with the engine, so I, I think we'll definitely make it a lot better than we could have in the past. Um, I honestly don't think it'll be too difficult, but it will be a lot of work. Um, fortunately, though, it's it's really just like most most things in my game are tile maps, uh, except for any physics object or like any object that changes the player state isn't obviously a tile map. But we can we can put it into a tile map. Um. But like, so like, for instance, like the fire traps, they can they have certain parameters on them, and so if we made a tile, like for instance, I think we'd have to make a tile map specifically for. Um. I guess interactable objects, um. And then based on that rotation, or or like yeah, based on the rotation of the object, we'd have to edit some parameters there. Honestly, maybe maybe it won't be maybe it won't be too difficult. Uh, I I don't think it'll be difficult, but I do think we'll have to do a lot of refactor, a little bit of refactoring, uh, specifically with um our time, obviously with our time maps, and then also with uh, any node that's like any any node that requires a manager, like these skulls that shoot lasers at you. We'll probably need to we'll have to do something with that. Or like, like how are we gonna how are we gonna put that into a tile map that this skull uh, follows a certain path? Um, and I, I'm not sure, but like maybe they're on a floating like technically they could be on a floating number right now. I, I think most almost everything in, in the game is on a grid, but technically we could we we could put it anywhere. Um. And I wonder if I want to give the player the ability to, to to mess with stuff like that. Also, welcome back. Welcome back, Camilos. What time is it over there? Like three or two? 2.30? Oh, shit, oh my god, I can't beat this room. Um, is Memory my first game? Uh, my first commercial game, yeah. Not my first game. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god.
shit dude oh my who the hell made this game oh my are we lagging Oh my god. This is not even the the like final stage. This is not even his final form. <gasps> oh oh. Oh my god, we keep missing. Yeah, there's a weird bug right now. See how there's like no music playing right now? I think we're like, I don't know what the hell is going on there. And then this final part, uh, I can't, I don't know how to get a part past this part. I think we changed the, uh, respawn rate. I have to like dash into this spring. Oh my God. Let's see. There we go. Naughty NPC. Imagine finding a way to overwrite the memory script using BB code and then doing it while NPC eventually keeps his stream open after raiding and changing some uh, at small things like the color of a plant. Imagine you can do that just with BB code. I hope that will be my my tonight's stream. What I can do with my overlay, I should do this where like uh, if the stream is offline, I should have it so that the bot doesn't run anything. Ooh, cause right now. Right now, it... Yeah. If someone runs a command, and I don't close it, it's actually still... You can still run the command, and it gets added. You know we have... Come on, you know we have the leaderboard now, right? I don't know if you saw that. The online leaderboard? You know, you still have the blurps, right? Yeah. Yeah, I want to get rid of the blurps, actually. I'm first at second. First at second and drink. Aren't you first at posture, too? <sighs> I think you are. I'm pretty sure you are. Mm 
Okay. Um, so we can do more overlay dev. I can export this. Uh, I'm trying to think if we have any other bugs we want to work on before we export the game. I did play. I did play it on the. On the debug, non-debug version. If you get first in a bunch of achievements, it would have to be equivalent to at least 100k. At least 100k. I'll be right back. I didn't, I didn't switch my camera. Oh my god. Holy shit. I just walked in, like, I went to the bathroom, and then I walked into my room, and dude, it's a sauna in my room. It's 90 degrees, 93 degrees in my room right now. What the hell? Nine degrees tells you nothing. 34 degrees Celsius. Did you wash your hands? Maybe. Do I look like someone who doesn't wash their hands after they go to the bathroom? Tell me, do I look like someone who doesn't wash their hands? Won't answer objection relevance. I won't answer until until you answer my question. All right, I'm letting my room fan, uh, air out, and then I'm going to turn on the AC because it's it's so hot. 72 hour stream. Let's do it. Holy shit, I'm sweating though. Oh, dude, why I look so. Why do I look so. I look so desaturated in this. In this version of me. In this camera. See?
Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. Uh, blah, 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 what was the rest? Uh, Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. Fuck, I forgot the rest. To the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, uh, something, something. Um, can I like, should I up my saturation? Let me see. What's the saturation on my main camera? Uh, where's my main camera? Yeah. What? I look so much like such a higher detail here, but I guess it's, it's also because like, uh, this one's a lot closer. This camera's a lot closer. Are you a ginger? Yeah. Uh, where the hell's my camera? Main overlay, top cam, main. Main cam, side test. I have this. Main overlay, where the hell's my camera? Oh, here we go. Uh, saturation. I said it's a point thirty, point thirty. But the thing is, the camera here is a lot different. There's auto here. Actually, let me see if I can update this camera. What the fuck? Why am I here? Oh yeah, I look like a gin I do look like a ginger here. I don't know why this camera makes my hair look orange. It's weird. I don't know why it does that. I do have filters on my hair, but like, it's not that orange. My hair looks like, like this, like what you see here. That's what it looks like. Um, what was I trying to do? I was trying to give my, myself more saturation or maybe less saturation. Can you see? Well, footwork. Amita Bus, you're on the push up grind. What the frick? Uh, wait, let me, let me update my. Yeah, dude, I look so. Boop, 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 boop. Let me see. Ah, that's better. Uh, see? Yeah, why do I look so, like, gray? Like, super gray here. Compared to my front camera. Maybe it's the lighting. There's, like, a lot of light. Let me see. If I block out the light. Yeah. It's the same. Never mind. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, shit. It was perfectly set up, and I ruined it. Shit. See, All right? Yeah, that's fine. Got you. All right, I will do this pretty soon. Let me just let my room air out. I ruined it. Is it actually ruined? Am I further away? You do see some of my. Here, wait. I have to use a stick to move it though. Because anyway. if I, I want people to tell, oh shit, no, we're making it worse. Oh no. Oh no. I think I'm I'm ruining it even more. I, fuck. Actually, we got it. We got it. TG, how's it going? You caught us at a at an awkward moment of. Us trying to fix our webcam here. Is that good? No, the angle's weird. Ah. How's it going, TG? Alright, is this good? Showcasing my 
showing my desk a little bit, but we could just do this. Look. There we go. I'll do like that. And then, oh shit, wait, what the hell? Where's my, why is my desk here? I don't want my desk here. Uh, you're right. Yo. You guys have a camera stick? Stick for moving your camera. Can't go wrong with the camera stick. Fuck, I'm, I think I'm making it worse. How do... Shit. You know, this this camera is so jank. We I should I should switch this one. We have this camera here. Wait. How's it going? Here, let me just switch to this one for now. How's it going, TG? We got the hairdo in multiple effects, yeah. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> How's it going, Sab? Thanks for the follow. Control Z. Can we control Z real life? Don't don't tell that to the pro-lifers. Got a dip? All right, TG. Thanks for the raid. I would come in clutch, yeah. Love the bow tie, by the way. Thanks. Enjoy your food. I'm trying to. We're we're kind of chilling right now. We just finished actually uh, releasing our demo, so I'm kind of just like relaxing. Uh, we're waiting on here. I'll move my camera so you guys don't see uh, multiple of me. Um, I do want to fix my camera. But yeah, I, I think I should switch these two. Uh, it'd be really easy too as well. Um, but yeah, I'm letting my room air out so I can turn on the AC. And then, do I know any other languages besides uh, English and GDScript? I mean... I'm familiar. My first language, programming language, was Java. Um, and then C++ and Python. Um, but yeah. Uh, I used to know Russian, actually. Or I was familiar with Russian growing up. No Spanish. Same with, uh, not really Spanish. I mean, like... I don't know. I grew up around Spanish speakers and like, I don't know, sometimes I know what they say, but like, I don't know. I can't, I can't hold a fluent conversation with a Spanish speaker. Um, same with Russian, but I can kind of understand Russian or not really, but like if I get lost in Russia, I would know how to speak Russian or like I would know my way around, I think. Gonna be dabbling in Godot uh, next month. See me on Reddit with S tier game dev tips, bro. See me on Reddit with the S tier game dev tips. All right, sounds good, buttermilk. Uh, Polish is kind of similar to Russian, but with the with Latin alphabet. I see. All right, let me close my door now. Oh, you guys are going to see my room. Wait, let me just turn on my AC.
Home, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Mm -hmm. Can you guys see? What the hell? You guys see some green screen? Green screen exposure. Wait, it's fixed up. You see? Mm -hmm. Oh, well, actually, first, here, wait, let's fix our side camera here. Oh my god, we gotta clean up our stream a little bit later on. What the hell? Oh my god. Here we go. Alright, where's my camera stick? Who touched my camera stick? It's over here. Boom. 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 Uh, also, there's some funny so-called false friends and uh, so-called false friends in some Slavic languages. Sukum Zichi. All right, I'm not gonna try to pronounce that. Would mean I'm looking for kids. Oh my god, what the hell? Oh my god, dude, what the hell? That's a. I feel like both of those statements, I mean, obviously one is worse than the other, but both, both of those sound weird to say. Sure. Can can we get like a decent camera setup? I gotta I gotta. Am I gonna do this right now? Fuck. Uh, should I switch these cameras? Let me see something. Mm. I spent so much work on these cameras though. Like to switch it now is like kind of annoying. But this one's all jank. Like it's kind of broken. And we can definitely put this one on. Wait, why is it broken though? Is it? Let's see. Yeah, let me switch to my other camera. <laughs> well, so I'm gonna delete that message. That's I don't want that in my in my chat history. All right. All right, so I'm going to throw this one in. Looking to implement inverse kinematics for two weeks now. It does work, but I can't get a stable... Uh, get stable with my with many constraints not even with pole directions uh i feel like i'm getting close but can't solve i need simpler uh, i need better gizmos do you know the feeling of solving a problem by simply simplifying it over and over again um yeah i mean uh that's definitely been the approach for uh for my game oftentimes like yeah i mean rewriting stuff helps and uh i've definitely broken down my mechanics over and over again i think it, it takes a lot of uh, specifically specifically with uh like design game dev design and then also uh, obviously with programming too like if you can break it down make it simpler then it just makes it that much better um obviously I'm not really saying much, but I know where you're coming from with like my mechanics. All right, hopefully I'm going to throw, I'm going to throw this onto my camera now and hopefully it looks good. I'm at a point of almost going insane. I, f I feel like I'm burning out. What's, uh, hmm. Yeah, I don't know. 
Mm-hmm. All right, so this is the same camera that we used before. Uh, also, Axe. Actual Axe Skull. How's it going? Mm-hmm. Right, hopefully. So this is a vertical <laughs> how I achieve this. I'll show you guys how I achieve, uh, I made this work after we after we get it going. But this will be a lot more stable. And actually, maybe even better quality. Let's see. It's the same camera, but I think the the one oh fuck, the one that I'm currently using Oh shit. Why is it? Why does it look worse? Why does it look flipped? Doesn't it look flipped? Oh yeah, yeah. It's flipped because I'm using a different all right, we'll have to figure that out. Anyway, I gotta get up. <laughs> okay. Don't worry. This is planned. All right. Uh, let me go back into my camera source here. And we just rotate. Oh, shit. And let me see. Can I grab both groups? I think we're going to have to do it one at a time. Mm-hmm. All right. And now we just have to figure that figure out the height. Um, let's see. It's bedtime. See ya, Yag. What is it like? Four or five a.m. over there. All right, this is, I think this is good, right? I can push it, actually. All right, have a good night. I think I can push it a little. Can I hold my camera a little bit? Hold the tripod a little bit. Ah, oh, come on, come on. It's a lot stronger than the last camera. Um, does this look good? No, fuck. Wait, let me see. Maybe, let's see, what if I move here? Oh, that's decent. I think I need to move the camera even more. Oh, yeah, that's better. Except my fucking mic arm is in the way now. What can we do about my mic arm? Uh, I feel like this is worse. Is this worse? Also, we could bring the camera way lower. Wait. Oh, dude, but my mic arm now is like so in the way. Fuck. What do we do about the mic arm? Let me see. How's that look? No. Yeah. Yeah, I think we're making it worse. Everything is going to shit. Um what do we do? Some camera setup stream, yeah. 
I can bring it closer. I wonder if that will... Let me see. I could try to bring it closer. No, that's too close, right? Oh my god, that's <laughs> too close. <laughs> Wait. Maybe. No, this is too close. Dude, I need, you know what I need? I need like a camera arm. Like, you know, like instead of a mic arm, a camera arm. Shit. It was so, it was like near perfect last time and I ruined it. Ugh. I don't know what to do now. I want to give up. No, practical. Just give up. Mm -mm. Let me see. I wonder what this camera looks like. Oh my god. Yeah, it looks worse. This camera is literally worse. I don't know what the hell it is, but yeah, what the hell? It's like, wait, let me see something. It's it's supposed to be the same exact camera. But obviously the cam what the hell is that? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Let me see something. There's some settings we uh I could mess with. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. What the hell? Are my glasses sideways? Dude, I, I feel like I'm wearing... You know, the, you know that filter that, like, <laughs> tilts your eyes? <laughs> I feel like that's happening to me right now. Alright. Figure video. What the fuck? Brightness is at zero. Saturation. Contrast? Usually I make it automatic, I think. Uh, what the hell? Reset. Sharpness. Oh, shit. Wait. I think we did something, right? I don't know what the hell I don't know what the hell it's doing, but it's doing something. White balance. We can do auto white balance. Why isn't contrast auto? Oh, wait, not contrast. Whoops. Uh, I want... Exposure, auto exposure. But even this is kind of crappy. Yeah, I look so bright. Low light compensation. Colors are relative, right? I mean, the issue I'm having with this though is that this is the same exact same exact webcam as the one that I'm that I, I was originally using, or at least the same exact brand, like same model and everything. So I don't know what the hell is broken about it. 
Let's see. Yeah, we can we can do a comparison. Symmetrical. So I'm trying to release the game in October, have a early access in October. Um, yeah. Wait, uh, but this is not the one. This is not the test I was going to show you. Here. See, look at that camera and look at this one. Like, this one looks so much better for some reason. Like, the quality looks better. Significantly better. Maybe it's, maybe it's dirty? No, I don't think so. It's just a little grease. Yeah, I mean, actually, that helped. Can't you maybe swap the camera? That's what I'm doing right now. I literally just swapped them. I'm trying to use this one. This was the camera, like... So this was the one that was flipped sideways. The one... The the way you saw me all, stream, all day today was you, me using this camera. Now... But it was in this, uh, it was using this tripod. Oh, shit. It was using this tripod. Uh, and now I'm trying to use the better camera for the tripod. That's what I'm trying to do. Since this is, this would be the camera that I'm using most often. So, yeah, I'm trying to figure out the best angle here, but I don't. I don't think we're gonna get it today. Mm -hmm. Oh shit! Oh, oh god! Mm -hmm. Anyway, I can rotate this one. Mm -hmm. I see. You know, I need to move. I have like too many, too much shit on my desk. That's the issue. Okay. Let's go. I think. So the issue also is that like. I don't have much space for my tripod unless I move my desktop. If I just moved my desktop slightly, I could move it right now. Oh my god. Okay.
Uh, yeah. And now... See? Once I set this up, I gotta make sure I never touch this camera again. Ugh, come on. Ugh. Is that good? Oh, dude, my mic arm is, like, in the way of everything, though. I mean, we could do that. It's not too bad. <laughs> Actually, that's not too bad. Actually, yeah, yeah, I kind of like this. Um, I do have to make it a little lower, though. Let's see. Uh, do I make it lower, or do I move my camera higher? Mm. Yeah, it's not too bad, actually. Uh, I'll probably mess with it off stream, though. A little bit more. Also, my can't my whoop and it's like. All right, there we go. I'll probably get a new, either get a new mic arm. Well, actually, I think I could push my mic arm a little bit more to the left. Have it stretch out some more. All right. It's kind of confusing that my main cam, eh, I guess it's technically true. This would be my new main cam. All right. I wonder, should I move it slightly? <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to ruin it. I move my camera slightly more to the right. Oh, also Oh, fuck. No. I ruined it. Actually, I could just move the camera. There we go. Okay. Um, game is ready. Uh, we've exported it. I guess the only thing left to do now is to actually post it. second
uh, low cost, and we have a preemptive uh, release schedule. So I'm trying to get the early access uh, out. That, that's what I'm trying to do in early access. Um, and get that out by October. Um, but I have, like, the, yeah, by October. Um, and then the actual, the full release of the game, though, would be in, um, hopefully in January 2025. Um, but yeah. I've also considered, though, um, I don't know, I might consider getting a publisher, though. Um, we'll see. See how that goes. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I've spoken to one publisher and I don't know, they seemed promising, but yeah, we'll have to see. I should actually contact them again pretty soon. Uh, when did I die? How's it going, Craft Stone? Um, when did I dye my hair? Uh, it's been like two months, I want to say now, since I dyed my hair. All right, just give me, um, give me a little bit while I set some stuff up. Uh, good games sell themselves. Um, so I have some plans, like, I'm sure the game can do well on its own, uh, but I think the game can do better with a publisher. Um, and I'm also not too concerned with, uh, I'm not too concerned with making, like, a lot of money from the game itself. Um, I'd rather get more sales than, uh... Yeah, I'd rather get more sales than more money. If that makes sense. I'd rather more have more people interested in my game. For instance, if I don't get a publisher, I like so uh the anticipated price is like five to fifteen. Oh, sorry, not five, sorry, ten to fifteen. Um but I want to uh yeah, if I get a publisher, I don't know, things might be different. Although, I think 15 is the max, though, I want to go for. Even with a publisher, I would say still 15. Optimistic about it? That makes one of us, I guess. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I, I think, I, I, yeah, I mean... We'll see. We'll see. Again, I don't really care too much for the, for the, uh, like how much it profits. It, I'm more so just concerned. Like if it becomes like a decent community, I think that's, that will be a win in my book. That's what I really want. Um, yeah. I mean, I heard recently, have you seen a single game that is great that did not sell well? Hmm. 
Hmm. I wonder. What the hell is this song? Okay, I can leave my camera here for now. Yeah, the camera setup is still funky. I have to I have to work on it pretty soon. Uh, but we'll probably do some overlay dev after this, uh, after I release the game, which should be like, well, again, I'm I'm gonna release it first for uh, on itch, and then after that we'll set up the the keys. Um, speaking of, I have to update that as well. Um, I have to update the, also I have to, so, you know, it's interesting though, uh, tiny teams, I, I would, I was convinced tiny teams would have looked at my game and liked it, or m maybe I submitted my game late and so they can, maybe they didn't play it or something. Um, but yeah, they didn't, they didn't respond. Mm practical it's 4 25 uh therefore time for me to sleep have a good one i'll see you see you camilos thanks for the stream uh and see you all chat have a good one sleep well uh all right um great time zone <laughs> All right. All right, I can... I'm taking my sweet ass time uploading this. I'm trying to remember which uh, which dashboards it which dashboards it which dashboard it's in. Oh, honestly, I could share this with you guys though. Kickstarter, and then I have another demo. I think this is the one that I sent before, so here, let me edit that one. Um, let me just delete whatever was here before. One download, that download was Tomer. Uh, 0 0.9.3.4. Uh, what the fuck? And now we're going to upload... Mm -hmm. Anyway, before I do that, let me save this page. Oh, fuck, wait, what am I doing this? Oh, actually, I mean, we could technically do it this way, but usually I just zip the whole file. Oh, it's easier to download. And actually, I think it'll be too large to download. We'd have to zip the PCK file anyway. Honestly, you know, I wonder. I can probably uh, export it as a HTML as well. Mm 
Am I allowed to play test? So I haven't set anything up for um, play tests. Um, basically, how? So I did a um, a Kickstarter, and we we had one of the tiers. One of the rewards for the Kickstarter was you would have um, private access to the to the play test. Um, so I'm trying to prioritize that first. Um, if all of that goes well. Um, then we'll we'll try to get more we'll try to get more people into the kick uh, into the into the play test uh but i need to prioritize first i need to prioritize uh that tier and then after that i need to prioritize backers uh but with the backers if i'm already going to give playtest access i'm going to give playtest access to uh you know people like like it's going to be for the backers like for all backers who who you know basically pre-ordered the game and then also uh anyone else who wants to join this game is gonna have multiplayer so it's gonna have it's it's semi multiplayer which tier is required so for the full private play test it was the thing is i don't i don't want to ask i'm currently i'm not asking anyone for for backing the project uh i haven't even spent the the money from the kickstarter yet we're still using it uh so i don't want to ask anyone for any more pledges just yet um but yeah i, I am working towards getting people on the on the play test so don't you worry um what was i gonna say yeah i, I you don't have to pay just to get to the play test but i do have to prioritize you know the people and not that many people. It's like, I think maybe like 50, around 50 people. Semi, okay, so semi multiplayer. So, okay, right now it's going to be, you know how um, FromSoft games are where you can, well, in FromSoft, in like, you know, the uh, uh, Dark Soul series, you can like join in and play with other people, but you can also see how other people like died and stuff like that or send messages to others. Um, so there's going to be that. And there's also going to be uh, ghost runs. So you can like race against people's ghosts. Uh, the thing is, if we already have racing against ghosts, we can probably go one step ahead and and like even get people to like be in the game with you. Uh, but there would be no actual interactions between you two. Uh, there is going to be like a there is a level editor, so there is like user generated content, um, and then also a karma system with that. So like points related, uh, points related with challenges, like speedrunning challenges, but also with creating levels and like, you know, kind of like, uh, um, if you ever played, uh, what's that other game? Shit, uh, Death Stranding sort of with the whole points and stuff. That's what I'm aiming for. That's what I'm trying to do. Um... But yeah, I think once I start doing multiplayer, um, it's gonna. I'm probably. I'm probably gonna overscope it. it is memory? Yeah, for sure. That's definitely something that I anticipate doing. Um, I do want to like definitely set up something for modders too, for modding. Uh, like make it very easy to mod. Actually, Tomer helped uh, helped with setting some mod stuff up, so. I'll probably, yeah, I'll probably, like, message him at some point, too. Multiplayer is hard. Yeah, um, that's why, that's why we're doing semi-multiplayer right now. And then if we can, if we can get that going, because, yeah, it's all going to be, you know, asynchronous, um, right now, at least. Um, and there's also no point of having multi, like, like, you know, uh, you know, like non asynchronous multiplayer in the game. Like there's literally no point, no, no advantage besides, you know, Hey, if this looks cool. All right. Um, did I, I didn't even upload the file. Oh, I think we were still zipping it. Here we go. Memory demo. Oh, dude, this up, this is uploading fast. Did, did I did I even put the files in here? Oh, it's still compressing. What the fuck? Oh wait, no, it's compressed. Mm -hmm. All right. 
612 megabytes. Is that what we got here? Wait, 620 megabytes. It was compressing. I think we messed up. Oh, wait, no, 620. Never mind. I'm bugging out. Dude, I have not slept in a hot minute. All right, give me one second. I got to set a password for this. Also allow a password to view the page. What the hell does this mean? I'm just going to generate another password. All right. I, you know, you know, what's funny. I'm not, I don't even care too much. Well, not that I don't care, but I'm actually really excited to work more on my overlay. I just want to finish this game so I can do more overlay dev. Um, but I am also really excited for, uh, Oh fuck, wait, this is the same exact password, not that. I'm really excited for uh for the level editor. I think that's gonna be the most exciting thing that I work on. Uh okay, overwrite this password. Uh why is it taking so long to save? Oh there we go. There's a problem with your project. Noun, expected text between one and twenty. I need a noun for my for my project. I have a project. A uh, noun. Uh, memory. Memory. There we go. All right. Let me just send the password to Tomer. Mm. <clears throat> Even when the base assets are encrypted, additional files uh, could be loaded still, and later practical could expose an API to do that but uh should make it way easier to rip the game basic uh because through that interface you could easily write out all assets right yeah i mean honestly any protection against like i don't know i, I don't really care for people like for instance i don't really care for people pirating the game um well yeah I don't know. I haven't really thought that that far out specifically for like, um, yeah, like, cause there's going to be skins in the game too. And the only way I can think of sending those skins to, to someone is through like, I don't know, either having deal free DLC or something. But the thing is the game's going to be moddable too. So yeah, every, like, we'll see, we'll see. The thing is, what's nice about what we're going to be doing, at least what I anticipate for for memory, is that like, again, I'm I'm prioritizing having a good a uh, good community. Also, the playtest is uploaded, so, um, yeah. Um, so we can we can chill now. Um, I'll wait for Tomer to hop on. Up, he'll probably play tomorrow, unless I stream for like unless I stream for twelve hours. We'll see. We'll see what happens. I could totally maybe perhaps stream for 12 hours or I can chill. And tomorrow is Spotlight Saturday, so we can do Spotlight Saturday. Um, and I can kind of relax and yeah, maybe we'll do 
shit. Because because I have Spotlight Saturday tomorrow, I have to. Uh, we're not gonna do a speed run in, uh, for any Kickstarter backers, or for anyone who has the keys. So like maybe Tomer will play it tomorrow. We'll showcase the game of Tomer playing. Uh, we'll do some Spotlight Saturday, and then uh, maybe next Friday we'll have all the keys available. I think that's what we'll end up doing. Can't part of Yeah, sorry, Zoomer. Like, I want to get more people into the playtest, but the thing is, like, it would make no, like, the thing is, I already backed, I already promised backers, a certain tier of backers, the playtest. So for me to be like, hey, by the way, never, like, remember that, that thing you paid for? I'm giving it away for free now. Like, that's, that's the issue. Uh, I'd feel weird if I, like, just didn't honor that, you know? At least for, like, at least for a couple of weeks, you know? Moning best part of Celeste, so seeing Fragile uh, taking Moning to heart. Yeah. And it, actually, I didn't even care too much. I, I didn't even care too much for modding when I first started. But no, seeing like especially because we're we're in software and game dev, I'm sure there's a, there are a lot of people who would be interested in interested in botting the game. So yeah, it would be pretty cool, I think. Mm -mm -mm. But I also want to set something up for it so when it does when the game does release, it's like you know, it's not like I mean it's with Godot, so like. Yeah, it wouldn't be too difficult to begin with, but I want to, you know, make it as seamless as possible, you know? And I mean, even making levels could be really easy because it's already made in Godot. Um, but yeah, I still want to make my own level editor too because it'd be fun. All right. Um, but anywho, we're done. We're done with the demo. Honestly, maybe I should chill though. Maybe I should chill, chill today. Should I do some overlay dev or do we just wait for Spotlight Saturday tomorrow? And then we can always work on the overlay tomorrow. <laughs> Because, yeah, we're going to have a busy day tomorrow. Fuck it. Yeah, we'll do overlay dev another day. Um, But I do know a fantastic overlay developer. What's Spotlight Saturday? I play test uh, a bunch of people's games. Um, Do I have a page for it? Let me see. I think there should be... Honestly, wait. Is there a link for it on... Let me see. Oh, am I not sharing my screen? Here. Uh, Spotlight Saturday? Is that? Is there no Spotlight Saturday? Oh, yeah, right here. Uh, this link is probably broken, though. Wait, what the fuck? It's a link? Why did I link this? I meant to... We have something called Spotlight Saturday, I think. Uh, uh, P slash applications. Here we go. Do, 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 do. All right. Um, I should probably update that Spotlight Saturday application. Oh, um, here, wait, let me edit this panel. Uh, I should put it in this description too, but where the hell is uh, events? Let's put this instead, applications. And then also, maybe I should put it... What did I want to do? I wanted to, oh, I wanted to update our FAQ. So here, we'll do some, we'll do some administrative stuff real quick too. Um, yeah, because a lot of people have been asking about the playtest. Uh, I don't know why they're asking me for, like, asking me if I have a playtest. Uh, it's like, it's like my title says that there's a playtest release or something. Um, 
Uh, um, are you full-time game dev? Blah, 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 blah. What should I say here? It's so hard to hard to read this in this editor. Let me open this. PCK files get loaded from these need to include the mod entry class extension or something. Uh, you can sanitize the scripts and show Godot's outputs while loading. Uh, but this is probably all obvious. No, I haven't looked into it. Uh, so, yeah. Um, I'm sure there's probably some some video on it. I, I know it's definitely possible to mod the game, though. Tomer's done some modding already. Um, what am I trying to do here? Oh, yeah, let me just open this in here. All right. Um, I'll just put it out here. Let me just copy this. Uh, and I join the playtest. But yeah, I haven't explored any of the modding, like any 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 modding related to Go. But um, I'm looking forward to it. Can I join the playtest? Um, right now I'm prioritizing. I'll say we've had right now I'm trying to get the private a test out for my Kickstarter backers. Yeah, I'll actually also just link to the Kickstarter so people can see that there's a thing. Um, I'm pretty sure we have a link to it from, uh, let me see, r slash r Kickstarter. Nice. Does the itch page have a demo there? Um, no. I don't think so. Uh, what's my name? PracticalNPC.itch.io. There is an itch page, but um, this is where I used to, I guess, post things. But there's an itch page. It just redirects to my uh, to my Steam page, though, or like just info about the game and like devlogs and stuff. Oh, uh, also, uh, in other news, we have Google ads on the, on the site now, which is kind of cool. Google ads on, or, yeah. Not on any, oh, I didn't realize it's on the applications. I don't think we should put it on the applications, to be honest, but, yeah, they are there, too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I used to post the the demo on like we we had a, we even had a demo for backers at some point too, um, earlier on. Um, but yeah, now it's gonna be a Steam page or Steam like an actual Steam playtest key. All right. Um, did I did I finish this? Oh, uh, yeah. There we go. There we go. Uh, right now I'm trying to get the private playtest out for my Kickstarter backers. Um, Perfect. Perfect. Uh, where's my FAQ? All right, here we go. Boom. Boom. All right. Uh, probably should capitalize that I. Stream leaderboard. All right, everything is good. Um. All right, who are we? Who are we rating tonight? Oh fuck! I didn't do sixty push-ups. Fuck. All right, fun. You know what? I'm a man of my word. Let's do these push-ups. See, I don't know if I can do sixty in in a row, but we'll try. All right, I have 15 more. In the meantime, I think we're going to go for Falonir probably. That's a good, good person to raid today. What the fuck? What the fuck, Craftstone Kebab? <sighs> All right, one, two, three, four, and we did five push-ups. All right, 35. Ooh. That's not too bad. Ugh. Ooh. Um, I'm just curious who else is streaming. Mm. Okay. But yeah, play, uh, Spotlight Saturdays tomorrow. Um, I made a list of people's games that I'm playing. Um, or who, whose games... Who has priority but if they're not in the stream that's okay we'll still play their games but uh if someone is on stream who submitted their game first or if they're on stream um i'll just play their game first holy shit, dude i feel so exhausted today i don't know i think the 14 hour stream got to us yesterday Ugh. 
Doesn't help them drinking lukewarm water. Ugh. All right, I want to start this raid, but <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to be able to do these push-ups. All right, uh, I'll start the raid, and it'll force me to finish the push-ups. Here. Hey, what the hell? Is Felonier watching me? What the fuck? Uh, wait. <laughs> They're watching me right now. Wait. Why are you watching me? <laughs> That's so funny. I just realized he's a Basie. Oh, I'll go for Basie. All right. Uh, hey, how's it going here? We're about to do some some push-ups. I was just about to finish my stream, but then someone redeemed even more push-ups for me to do. Okay. Uh, already. Hope you're happy, Craftstone. Uh. Alrighty. Uh, if you guys don't know, uh, Falinir, check out Falinir. We were about to raid them. Uh, we'll go for Basie instead. It's a cool name to have on, on Twitch. I'm surprised it's not taken. I mean, they've probably been around for a while then. All right, let's start the raid since, since uh, Ali just started it. Whew. All right, till next time, people. If you'd like to wishlist my game, you can find it here. Uh, they shouted me out. That's funny. Well, I'm about to rate them. Uh, if you'd like to join Discord, you can find that uh, here. All right. Bye. Oh, there's ads playing. I see.